a a test 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 one two one two can you guys hear me ah uh, uh, hello everybody welcome to saturday online with me mina aoyama welcome in everyone harry young thank you for the tier one i appreciate you greatly and pulley mike thank you as well for the tier one also vanna subbed offline thank you for the tier three i appreciate you greatly welcome in everybody welcome welcome let me go over here welcome guys to a stream i don't know why i thought today was monday like like today felt like a monday for some reason probably not to most people but but to me it, it feels like a monday and i don't know why because the entire time people were telling me tomorrow tomorrow and i'm like okay tomorrow's tuesday and and in fact tomorrow is not tuesday tomorrow is sunday but hello everybody oh is the music still up thank you the music is at different sound levels for every freaking tab it's annoying welcome because you're a workaholic why are you being so loud why are you why are you being so loud about that hmm what's my, my star rail pfp wow that's new normally i get it for like the uh this thing um this is from a web event that star rail held a while ago i don't think it's available anymore so um get good but yeah it's 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 from a web event but welcome in everybody hi hello yes we hit partner plus gamers we hit partner plus six out of oh it's six out of 12 bricked accounts still there no 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 it's gone now it's gone the accounts are no longer bricked i'm not responsible anymore for the bricketing <laughs> guys i watched the absolute bricketing that happened thursday night and i'm really glad now i didn't ask her to pull cck me this one time dude dude there was something about sparkle i swear i swear they they lowered the rates for sparkle because every content creator pulled like dog water pulled like dog water didn't you say that we will do a genshin watch along we we did i we we did watch it together we we watched it yesterday on youtube we were live over it was it was me you and like three thousand people we we watched it together yesterday <laughs> Yeah, on you. Special programs are YouTube exclusive. Oh, uh, Guardian, thank you for the tier one. Thank you. One year on my birthday. Oh, happy birthday. I managed to get E2 Spark after a All right, good job, good job. Bro's not a YouTube frog. I know, right? That's objectively not true. Poke got me E6 S8 in 1,000 pulls. Everyone else just Are sucks. you admitting that you went to another streamer to do your polls? Hmm? Are, are you... Are you admitting on TTS that you're a traitor? Hmm? Hmm? Bringing up another streamer? Perhaps. In my chat? can't believe this a bannable offense hmm. <laughs> hmm. listen listen i could sense your un your, your i could sense your wavering loyalty and thus whatever pulls i did for you were were scuffed because your loyalty wasn't 100 percent for me and 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 the luck the gotcha gods could sense it so those who got lucky had had un, undeniable faith in me. But the moment that faith wavered, you would be punished. It's a like divine smite on your gotcha account. Anyways, so... Oh, Final Fantasy Freak, thank you for the 10 gifted. Thank you, I appreciate that. <laughs> thank you, you guys. If you got gifted a sub, please make sure to say thank you to your sub daddy. And appreciate the ad-free viewing experience and the emotes. Welcome in, everybody. Welcome in. <laughs> I had faith in you and it cost me $300. Well, well, it wasn't unwavering faith, you know? 
there was a sliver of doubt. No, it needs to be like a cult. You have to you have to have un unwavering loyalty for me. Have I seen Sparkle EXE? Yes, I've watched it already. Anyways, is this live? No. Okay. Anyways, welcome in guys. The plan for today. The plan the plan for today. Um is the Genshin is HSR live stream uh next week. I E sixty Sparkle. Know. What does that make me? Elation. Yes, you are elation. We are all elation. Our elation, you know? Um I believe okay, based on previous trends, it would make the most sense that the Honkai Star Rail live stream would be next week. But Oh come on at this point I have as many bannable offenses in this channel as I have bits. Literally. <laughs> I bully you every time I cheer, Kek. <laughs> Thank you for the hundred tread. <laughs> Thank you, thank you. I think I'm going to let you do my adventure in pulls when he comes out of the closet. Sweetie, he was never in the closet. But but thank you for the biddies. Um, what was I gonna say? I was gonna say guys, uh, guys, stop distracting me. Guys, I'm trying to talk. And and you guys keep distracting me by throwing me money. Can you guys stop for like ten minutes so I could I can think about what I'm what, what I'm trying to say? He is a distraction. You made a typo, by the way. <laughs> Ludia, you made a typo. <laughs> Clueless, thank you for the five. Thing. Guys, stop. I want to think. I want to thank you guys. Meg, um, Megla, thank you. Thank you. Mega, Mega Laser, thank you for the prime as well. Thank you guys. Thank you guys. If you guys get to the sub, make sure to say thank you and appreciate the happy viewing experience and the emotes. Anyways. Guys, what was I saying? Shit. What was I saying? What was I saying? Um, guys, what was I saying? I was saying some anniversary. On the 6th is my anniversary. Oh, thank you guys for Partner Plus. Thank you. Oh, the Honkai live stream. Thank you. Okay. So the Honkai live stream, if it's, if you're going by trend. I'm about to turn off alerts. Mina, there's a phrase I think would be quite apt in this case. Just shut up and accept the money kick. Hey, no, I'm at the, I'm at the turn off alert so I could get through a sentence. Okay. Um, okay. 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 So if things are going by trend, if things are going by trend, then yes, the star rail live stream should be next week, but that makes too much sense for Hoyoverse. That makes way too much sense for Hoyoverse. So I, I have, I have, I have a feeling it's probably not going to be next week, but the week after. But, but I'm, yeah, because it's a seven week patch instead of six. And I think they like to make the live stream like two weeks before the, like the, the, like the drop, like the, the update. So it might not be next week and it might be the week after, which is unfortunate. I would prefer it to be next week, but you know, it is what it is. Yeah. It makes too much sense. Yeah. For a sparkle release match. Exactly. Around 10 days before. Yeah. So we're probably not going to get it. Tips on how to defeat swarm difficulty five, um, E6 Kafka. Now just get two preservation units, you'll probably be fine. Um, or like two sustainers, you'll you'll be fine. You will take our money and be elated, Kappa. Kappa? No. Do I, do I look like a uh -huh. DOT makes swarm easy? Does it actually? Anyways, guys. So, so so, gamers, 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 gamers. My lovely chat. My lovely, adorable, cute little chat. Today, the plan is we're going to play a little bit of Star Rail. Just a widow, like a little bit. And then we're going to switch over to reverse. And and we're going to finish chapter four today. We're finally going to finish chapter four because, because it is the long-awaited, the long-awaited 1.4 update. Okay? I have been freaking waiting waiting for 1.4 it looks so good like this update looks so freaking good we're also gonna try to roll we're we're gonna try to roll for 37 um i i can't guarantee i'm gonna get her hopefully i'm not gonna spend money we're not gonna spend money you know but but we're gonna we're gonna try to get her i'm gonna love chapter five i'm oh my god we need to finish chapter four i i heard chapter four is really good though like you guys have been dying for me to finish chapter four and like for like a while now 
We will be spending money. No, 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 no. <laughs> Mina, when are you going to play reverse 1999? Hey, hey, listen, listen, we're going to, we're going we're gonna to try. Okay. So, so today's plan is we're going to, we're going to try to, we're going to finish chapter four. Like for sure. We're going to finish chapter four and maybe start chapter five. Um, and then we're going to definitely play chapter five on Tuesday. Aside from that, you guys, we're so close to my three-year anniversary. My three years of being a streamer. That should be really fun. Clementine, thank you so much for the Prime sub. I appreciate that. Thank you. So on Wednesday, you guys are going to get a super special live stream on, on Wednesday. 12 hours. 12 whole hours. Three years of being unemployed like when I found... Um, actually... I've only been unemployed for almost one year. All right. I only went full time last year. Okay. Okay. The first two years I had a full time job while streaming. Okay. Get your lore correctly. You mean 12? No, no, not 20. No, no. A streamer. No, no, 12 hours, you guys. 12 hours. We're going to start at 10 a.m. And we're going to end at 10 p.m. All right. So finally, the Europeans. You guys, you guys can stop complaining. Why does Mina never stream at a good time for us? Oh my god, Mina hates us. Oh my god, Mina always says that Europe's not real. You guys are finally, you guys are finally getting a whole ass stream. 12 hours, 12 hours. Most of the time zones will be able to enjoy it. I agree, it's 2 a.m. <laughs> Thank you guys for the, for the hype train. I, I, I appreciate you all. But you do say all those things? Yeah, and I'm not wrong. And I'm and I'm not two, 12 hours of citrus, bro. You wish. You wish. 2 a.m., bro. Oh, my God. Wait, want to chat if you're European? Why are you guys awake? Go to sleep. Not really a good time for Asian bros. We lost this. Th what? It's 12 hours. At some point, it'll be good for Asia. Why is there so many ones? There's no way you guys are all in Europe. There's not that many people in Europe, is there? I have insomnia. Two a it's 9 a.m. It's 2 a.m. I'm watching you at 4 a.m. Hello from Russia. Why are you awake? You guys go to sleep. Hello? Hydra. Okay, buddy. Okay, two in chat if you're from America. Three in chat if you're from SEA. And then four in chat if you're from other. All right, there you go. There's more twos. There's more twos. Oh, some threes. East Coast USA represent. Two, Ohio. The stream note have woke you up. Oh, good morning. Us in Australia where it's the middle of the day. Oh, yeah, Australia. Australia, mate. You know, I was at the grocery store with my mom the other day. And we got something that was made in New Zealand. And I was like, hey, mom, did you know? That a New Zealand person living in Australia is called a Kiwi. And she didn't believe me. But, but, I knew I was correct. Because I watch Love Island Australia. I, I'm right. No, they're, they're actually, like, I'm right though. Can the Australians in chat confirm? Can, can, can the Australians in chat confirm that I am correct in this? Can, can they confirm? A Kiwi is a New Zealander living in, in Australia. No, like, it's, it's, it's for real, for real. Even if, in, um, even if you're in New Zealand and living in New Zealand, they're called Kiwis, really? A Kiwi's just a New Zealander? Huh? We call them Kiwis in Canada too. What? Wait, why do people just call New Zealanders Kiwis? Wait, why are, why are they just called Kiwis? What does it stand for? It has to mean something. Why are they all called Kiwis? I, I did. Because Kiwis are from, are from New Zealand. Kiwis, the national bird? Huh? So there's a bird, a New Zealand bird called the Kiwi. And they named their whole lot. Huh? Do you think kiwi is literally just the fruit? Yeah, I just I just thought they were calling them fruity. 
it. Like, like I, just, I thought they were talking about like kiwis, like like the fruit. Like, I, I actually thought they were referring to the flute. No, the flute, the fruit. It's a literal bird. There's no way. You're lying to me. Hold on. Kiwi bird. Aww. Wait, let me show you guys. Um. It looks like a kiwi. It's just a little guy. So that's why they're called kiwis? Are they edible? Well, I mean, like, aren't most birds edible? I think anything's edible if you try hard enough. The image of the kiwi slices? Bruh. Some things are only edible once? Yeah. Oh, guys, look. Hold on. So you remember last stream? Do you, guys, do you guys remember last stream where I stole the screenshot from from someone? Do you guys do you guys remember me stealing the screenshot from someone's account? And I said, "Holy shit!" as if as if I'm the one who wrote this, who got this right. Oh, Brax was so funny, dude. But but but, thank you, thank you for the thank you for the tip. Um, guys, thirteen thousand likes. 13,000 likes, 300,000 views, okay? I have never been cursed. Bird. <laughs> Dude, you always said to make up the typo. You guys, I, I have never been cursed in so many different languages. I've actually never been more cursed in my... Like, the amount of quotes in, in different languages that I got... Like, can I, can I find some? I don't know what this says. I feel like I got cursed. Like, like I, there was just so many non English things I was getting yelled at in. I don't know what this is, but I feel like they're I feel like they're cursing me. I just I just I just feel like all these people are cursing me. Be, like I just like the entire I, I, all, all, like, <laughs> In the way, the way it's not even mine. The way it's not, the way I lied. The way I fully lied about, about what I... <laughs> we love Mina spreading misinformation. Okay, this person knew. This person's in chat. This person knows. <laughs> Dude, people were so bad. People were so bad. It's so funny. It's so freaking funny. Funny. But yeah. Yeah, not mine. Um, it's what you get for lying. Bro, this got me to two on, uh, to 20k on Twitter though. Listen, we hit we hit 20k. Oh, oh, do you guys do you guys see this um this image? Huh. 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 I wonder what hmm. Hmm. I wonder what this is about. Hmm. You know, chat, keep your eyes open. That's all I could say. Really exciting things are about to happen, and they're about to go into motion very, very soon. So you have to keep your eyes out, okay, guys? Because otherwise, otherwise you'll miss something really exciting. You're welcome for that post-engagement BTW. <laughs> I will take your X premium revenue as Venmo payment. I don't have premium. Um, gets the Strap Sisters. Oh my god, it's the Strap Sisters. Do you guys want to see the full art for this? It's really pretty. It's, it's really pretty. Let me, hold on, let me, let me pull it up. One second. 
Isn't it nice? I'm so proud of myself. I didn't have a typo for once. I know. I'm so proud of you. Thank you. Is this so cute? Is this so freaking cute? Why does it look like you forced me to take the? I would never. I I would never. Numi looks over whatever's happening. What do you mean? She loves being here. She loves being here. What do you mean? The smug is even better in high def. I know, right? But yeah, guys, just keep keep an eye out. Keep keep an, keep an eye out for 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 what may come. Okay. Why is she pouting? Why not? She looked bribed. No, 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 guys, guys. No, 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 no. No, 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 no. It's 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 chill. It's chill. Okay, let's play the game so we can play reverse. Wait, let's listen to that song again. One second. Okay. Why is why is Jing Yuan standing there so menacingly? Why why is um um, why is he, why is he standing there so menacingly, dude? Dude! Judging you for skipping? Hey, 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 hey. He's coming for you because you didn't pull him? Yeah, 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 whatever. Whatever. He didn't want, we gave him 30 whole pulls, okay? And he, and he didn't come home. Okay, so let's do our dailies. We we must we must do our dailies. Okay, let me turn on some audio a bit. All right, oh, let me look at the characters real quick. Ding dong dong bing bum bum bing bum bum boom. Oh, okay. I need to level up this light cone. So we'll do uh, the calyxes. Bum, 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 bum. You should get E6. Um. No, thank you. Oh my god, when's the new mock happening? I want to be able to show off all these characters. E6 Akron? No. Guys, no more E6s. No more E6s. Unless, I told you, there's only two cases. There's only in which two situations that I will E6 a character. And and that is time to say um, goodbye. Boom. Wait, hold on, sorry. Um, two cases in which I would get a um, a, a E6. March seventh, five star, and and a Kiana. Time to say bye. What happens if I just... What do you mean? The auto button is so I can stay a just chatting stream, you know? Oh, yeah, you guys. For those who play reverse, I was going to bring it up when we actually start playing reverse. They gave me a code to share with you guys. I don't know if this code's already been uh, announced uh, online. But reverse live, you'll get 60 crystals or 60 of the drops. I don't know if the code got released online or not yet, but they gave me that code to share. So there's that Time to as well, a little, a little extra boost. They're so nice. I love the reverse team, dude. They're so sweet. Firefly is close enough to Kiana. Yeah, too bad she got stabbed. Sounds like I'm downloading reverse and use my link. Should you start playing reverse? Yes, you guys. Like, I know this is a sponsor stream, but I'm not even in the sponsor segment yet. Like, I like, I like reverse. Reverse is a good ass game. The rewards were insane this time around. I logged in on um on on the 29th because that was the patch update, and I got over a thousand uh, of the the drops. It was amazing. You're also getting a free five star right now in reverse as well. So so there's that. It's so stylistic and the I love how stylistic it is and I love the story. It's so good. Beneath the water lies an endless abyss. Time to say bye. 
Me and a Honkai character win. Gwenaifen's right there. The way you're just erasing Gwenaifen is insane to me. Icon is the reason you want reverse into 99. I love red flags. Damn listen, stop. listen, you guys. All will be swept away by Arcana is not just a red flag. She's like a whole ass billboard of red. She is like a sea of red. As far as the sky can go, that's how red she is. If she's a red flag, then I must act colorblind, bruh. And Sparkle isn't? Well, Sparkle's short. Like, listen, you guys. Sparkle? Like, what has Sparkle actually done? Other than, like, like stand there menacingly. Come with us, they give it a tier one. Like, what is what has Sparkle actually done? Probably murder? Well, was it proven? Was it, was it proven? Racism? Be swept away by the wind. Well, we can fix that. Identity theft? I mean, don't people online all the time pretend to be someone else? Um, I'd, I'd argue against homophobia. She's pretty gay. Could Sparkle turn into a trash can? Probably tax evasion? Bro, I wish I could commit tax evasion. Thus, I cannot. But oh God, I wish. Time to I feel like we need to watch the line again between Sparkle and Black Swan. That was such a good line. Let me see. Is that enough to get it to um, 80? All right, let's see. Where is she? Where's my little, our little racist? Change. Dun, 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 dun. Um, bro, I don't have any of these. Um. Check Sparkle's voice line about Black Swan. Oh yeah, we watch we watch them all. Oh wait, it's a new month. <gasps> it's a new month. It's a new month. It's a new month. That's not the one I meant to do. Anyways, it's a new month. Oh my favorite. Oh my god. My favorite time. My favorite time of the month. Wait, why are these? What do you mean one more day for this? Why is why is this one a day? Why why wait 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 why is this one a day? All the other ones. Are, uh, I'm offended. I'm actually offended. <laughs> Okay. Well, that was not as, as much as I thought it was going to be. Wait, where did I get so many pulls from? Oh, 30. Oh. I didn't realize how many I got. Come on. Where's my five star? It'd be crazy if we got another Bronia. I would scream. Oh, those codes are old, bro. <laughs> oh, wait. Stream Elements also has a thing. Hold on. Let me turn that off. Discard your worthless desk. Focus on the Nightbot one. The Stream Elements is a liar. One second. 
Black Swan is just perfect. Hell yeah, she is. Um. Cat hmm. commands. Memories seem this. to be different oh. again. Okay. Okay, um... Where's Sparkle? Where is she? Okay. I still need these, this shit. I feel like it actually might be easier to do the other ones than these. The, the lesser ones. Where is it? Like this one? No. This one, because I feel like I should have a shit ton of of these. And we'll do like that much. Okay, and then we'll... And then we'll go to synthesis. And we'll do like this. Perfect. And then auto. Awesome. Are you shitting me? I need one more of those. Just do that. Ascend. We do that. Can we get her to 80? Can we get her to 80? I need two more. Oh, Riz! Thank you so much for the, the tier one. Thank you. I appreciate that. Thank you. Alright. Ascend. And we do that. Okay, perfect. Alright, not bad. Not bad. I, still 151 speed. She could be faster. I still think that's pretty decent. 208 crit damage. I feel like it could be higher, but we don't even have like a full set on her. We kind of just went with what works. She's she's kind of rainbowed right now, you know? Yeah, good start until I'm actually able to like, you know, get her like into like a proper thing. Um, eights across the board, not the best, but you know, it's what we what we have at the moment. Let's see. Okay. Is it worth to go? Oh, because I want the 10 crit. Oh, that's kind of sexy, you know? Okay. I need to be level 75. I... I have to be level 75. Okay, um... Grinding? Alright, that should be good. Alright. Perfect. Where is she? We only need to 75. I don't- I'm not gonna waste the books right now. Okay. Awesome. Okay, 218 crit damage. Not bad, not bad. At level 75. Okay, okay. Easy, easy, easy clap. We did this, we did that. Guys, we're that girly pop. Yeah, not bad, not bad. All right. And now it's time to start farming um, the speedy set again because we hate our lives here. Oh, nice. 
All right, let's do Cavern of Corrosion, our favorite set ever. I hate that Sparkle is one of your favorites. Now, guys, the marketing, the absolute marketing genius that Hoyoverse like did with Sparkle is insane. She literally went from no one caring about her to three back-to-back -back banger trailers and everyone loving her because of it. Like, is she not like insane for that? Did TNB put like the Sparkle song yet on, on Spotify? No, why do they hate me? Why do they hate me? Can they just put it on already? They did? I don't see it on Spotify. Relax. He's all spicy in the story. I love her, dude. I told you guys she was going to be freaking amazing. And no one believed me. Who? Who would use this? I don't have blade. I don't have blade. You have Arlen? Then pull no. Clara? Watch it all go EHR and I'll like kill myself. That was a joke. That was a joke. Just, should feel like I have to state that. It was a joke. It was a joke. I was joking. Time to say bye. In Minecraft, yeah. In Minecraft, exactly, exactly. In Panacone, in Panacone. Yeah, 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 yeah. In, in, yeah, 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 guys, 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 yeah, yeah, yeah. Gamers, I played Minecraft so much yesterday. I was playing Minecraft for so long yesterday. I don't even have time. And I found time to waste in Minecraft. Stand still. Yeah, off stream I was playing Minecraft, you guys. I made a little village. It looks really pretty. It looks really pretty. My little my little Minecraft village. We figured out how to make the shaders work. Time to say bye. Minecraft streamer. Do you, I don't think you guys would have fun watching me play Minecraft. Because you know what I do? I have a YouTube video on the side showing me how to make a build and I'm just copying it like like you know verbatim. I'm not saying a single word. Be my number one man. That's how I play. Yeah, I just like the, I I I bit uh, my tongue. I just like the build. Molly screaming at everything. Dude, we went exploring and we got so much shit. We got like, we had like 40 diamonds. And then we were building our way up because we didn't know how to get out of the cave. And, and we hit water and we drowned to death. Do you understand how upset I was? Do you understand, like, like genuinely how upset I was? Me what you like r r r r r At least you went out together. No, but all of our stuff. Oh no, yeah, no, there was we were both screaming. A zero, thank you for the prime sub. Thank you, I appreciate it. Holy shit, we already hit the sub goal? Time to say bye. Guys. Boom. I, hello? I just put the sub goal. All will be swept away by the wind. We are crazy. Yeah, you guys are crazy. Thank you. Nana, thank you for gifting three months to Bad RNG Girl. Thank you. I appreciate that. Thank you so much. Thank you guys. Yeah, thank you for all the primes. Thank you for all the tier ones. Thank you guys for helping me get partner plus. Thank you guys. Thank you. I really do appreciate it. And and and, and thank you guys. It took a lot for me to ask you. And, and then you guys... And you Oh, 
Did I hear Subgirl? No, 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 you didn't. You didn't hear anything. You heard nothing. Gilvarius, thank you for the prime. Oh? Yeah, that's a minus one sub right there. Oh, yeah, buddy. Oh, yeah. Imagine the last subset speed. Imagine. A attack percent or speed would be crazy. Time to say bye. Basil, thanks. Thanks for the 10. Thanks, thanks for the 10 gifted. Thank you. I, I appreciate that. Thank you. Thank you so much. Thank you guys, thank you, thank you, I appreciate it. Guys, if you guys give it a sub, please make sure to say thank you to your sub daddy and appreciate the ad free viewing experience and the emotes. Thank you, thank you guys, thank you. I really do appreciate that. Thank you all. We're gonna switch over to reverse soon. I'm so excited for, for 1.4. Trash. Trash. Guys, wasn't it so crazy that Sparkle just gave us 10 fuel? I love that they do Time that. Say bye. I love that they give us, like, canonical characters giving us fuel. Like, remember, guys, do you remember when March 7th hosted one of the live streams? Which I, I love and, I, and I, I still, that's still one of my favorite live streams. But when March 7th hosted the live stream and, and she just gave us 10 fuel, do you remember that? Do you remember how crazy she was for that? She's like, hold on, let me text. Like, oh, like, let me make sure my friend was watching. And then, and then she just gave us 10 fuel because she loves us. Didn't Wolfie give us 10? I think Silver Wolf did give us 10 at some point. Did I see Regulus hosted the reverse live stream? I did, dude. Her voice actor sounds exactly like her. Okay. All right. Why is there crit damage on this piece? What is this? Time to say bye. Wow, well, today's been a pretty lucky day. I feel like for for relics, we gotta we gotta pull them. Yeah, so we'll pack the game to give us ten fuel. Yeah, 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 yeah. All will be swept away by the wind. You want crit damage though? Oh yeah. That's a sparkle piece? Okay. Time to say it's the Mina weekend buff, two eggs lucky relics. Oh, you're so right. Dude, this team is so fast. Where is she? I wonder about those boots. Not, wait, not these boots. No, it wasn't boot. Did it, what was it? Was it the arm? Ah, this one. Four star and below. Salvage. Attack percent, attack percent, speed. Attack percent or speed. Attack percent, speed. It's better than defense. It's better than defense. It's better than defense. Okay. 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 Curse of defense. There was no defense on that piece. Crit, crit. Okay, what about that one, the crit damage body? Oh, 
We're gonna ignore that. Um, whatever, I'm not going to use that. Every day, every day I hate this game. Every day I hate this game a little bit more. Every single day. I just, I wake up in pain. At least it wasn't deaf. At least it wasn't deaf. Yeah, you're so right. But sometimes it, it, it hurts more. Sometimes, sometimes it just hurts, you know? Why is it always defense? Why is it... Why is it just, like, always defense, though? I don't understand. Like, I, I actually just don't understand. Defense just sounds better typed out. I don't even know which ones to get rid of. Get it to nine at least. Okay, I can't even get it to nine. Oh! Oh! Okay. Okay, okay. I'm never getting my hopes up ever again. I'm never, ever in my life getting my hopes up ever again. Do you guys see what happens when you get your hopes up? I pray you roll only into defense and nothing else. Please let it all roll into death. Time out, Basil. Time out, time out, Basil. This is unacceptable. This is, this is, this is unacceptable. I can't believe this. I actually, I'm, I, I hate this game. You guys never have hope because you will only ever be disappointed. This is literal confirmation that you will only ever be disappointed in this game. If, if you ever have an ounce of hope, just never have hope ever to begin with. Okay. 
they baited me. They baited me with the one crit damage as my first one. And they're like, ooh, it's gonna be a good piece. Ooh, it's gonna be so good. Don't worry, don't worry. Ooh, it's gonna be so good. It's gonna be so good. Oh, this piece is already good. Why did I even bother rolling another piece? I'm back in my Nihility arc, bro. Aha uh -huh, has been playing too many games with me recently. It's fine. It's fine. It's whatever. I'm fine. And we hit weekly limit. Don't lose M. Never mind. Mina, you can do it. Mina, our heart. Don't lose momentum. An old friend has sent you a message request. My dear, are you there? Warning, this account has been reported by multiple users. You and this user currently have no mutual friends. Please be cautious during your interaction. Old friend. I'm your old friend. I hear you're in Pentaconi too. Fancy meeting up. I have no friends. <laughs> Ah, sorry, I think I got the wrong person, but perhaps this is fate. Have you heard of the Charmony Festival? There's going to be performance by Robin, a singer known across the cosmos. I have a ticket. You want to buy a ticket? If you don't have a ticket, you can buy one from me. I've got as many as you need. Are you serious? These tickets are almost impossible to get a hold of. How did you manage to bag so many? You didn't do anything illegal, did you? Looks like the market isn't looking at great at the moment. I just can't sell these tickets. Fortunately, that wasn't the business I was calling you about. Robin had two back, uh, backing performers that had to drop out due to sickness. I received a quota to fill in and I thought of you straight away. I can teach you the steps and you can head out straight out on the stage. What do you think? This feels like a scam. Tell me more. Guys, what if we get to meet Robin? I'm not clicking this link. I'm not clicking the link. Warning, please do not use... I know I shouldn't. I know I shouldn't. Oh, I can use a picture of Sparkle? I can use a picture of Sparkle? Oh? You've been spamming too much? The system is sending out scam warnings? No way! I didn't get them on my end! This is terrible! These system warnings are so annoying! And what's wrong with reaching out with a, uh, to an old friend to get back in touch? I ate your friend. <laughs> yeah, have we met before? What, I can't text you just because I haven't met you? Fine, forget it. I'll come back with something fun for you next time. <laughs> Wait, that's funny. That's so funny. I like how they're bringing up the fact that we just haven't met. Because, like, we, we haven't technically met. We haven't actually met Sparkle. She's mean to her Sparkle all the time. No, I don't think she's being mean. I think she's, uh, she's playing around. Can you click the link? No. <laughs> That's funny. I like that. I need to do this, this, this quest. Whatever. All right. It's time. Tis time for tis tis time for reverse. We're going to be playing chapter chapter 4. We're going to finish it. Just a, gen a gentle reminder, use my link if you haven't downloaded the game yet. I think it's really fun, and I feel, I feel like you guys should you guys should try it out. 
da, 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 da. Let me pause the music because I like reverses music a lot and I want to listen to it. Um, let me aim up so you guys can see it. Oh, yes, Mina's British accent's coming back at you. Coming back at you live from, from wherever I am. Okay, guys, I don't know which five star to pick. I also need to turn up the, the volume. I don't know which five star to pick. You guys, we get a free five star. Is that not insane? Is this is this not like crazy? The way I have all of them, at least one of each, is kind of a little a little crazy, you know? A, a little a little cuckoo even. Borg, uh, how do you pronounce your name? Is it Bacorn Bacorn Blue? Corn Corn Blue? How to pronounce your name? Corn or balloon? But balloon party scares me. Tenant. Corn. Be corn bloom. Get the girl kisser. They're all girl kissers. Except for Click. He's a boy kisser. You just say bloom. Corn starch. <laughs> corn bloom. Be corn bloom. Sweetheart. I actually started leveling up Sweetheart because I, I really like her new outfit. What about X? I already have four of him. Maybe I should get a necrologist. I only have two of her. I, like, I have six of DK. I have six of Satsuki. Five of Tenet. Five of Corn Bloom. Five of Sweetheart. Four of Charlie. Four of Baby Blue. Uh, four of X. Three of Diggers. Three of Click. Two of necrologist. And two of Balloon Party. Her eye too is really pretty. I'll, I'll look at it. Max Bloom, is it worth it? My my DK, oh she's already fully. I can ignore her. We'll do we'll do Corn Bloom then. But Corn Bloom. Are you a brave speaker? You look like one. Thank you. Let me turn up the audio. Okay, guys, go here if you have an account and type in. Reverse live. I already did this, so I can't do it again. But, 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 do this, you guys. The reverse team was kind enough to give me a code for you guys to use. You'll get 60 drops, and and you'll get um one of the jar things, the, the Prisma whatever candies. So, reverse live. Enter that in, and you'll get 60. I don't know if this is a new code or whatnot, but they gave me a code to share with you guys. Yeah, fuel and 60. Here, I can show you. Wait, it went away. It went away. I got it, though. I got it, though. I got it, though, but it went away. I already, already claimed mine. It is new. I got fuel. Nice. Got it. Nice, nice. You want to play reverse, but where's your link? Exclamation point. Reverse 1999. Use my link today, you guys. Right now, they're having their mystery box carnival. It's awesome, okay? It's actually awesome. Look at the sweetheart skin. You guys. You guys. I started leveling her up. I... I started leveling her up because of how nice this skin is. It is nice. Like... Can we just appreciate? Guys, 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 guys. Can we appreciate this thing right here? Can we, can we all, can we all just, can we, can we just appreciate right here? I, I feel like, I feel like this is, this is really poggers. I feel like this is really nice, you know? Like really very, very extremely nice. It, it's super, super nice and super poggers, you know? The code is reverse live. I literally bought, guys, guys, I, I, I bought the skin, I, I bought the battle pass so I can get her skin at level 30. I, I, I already, I already bought the battle pass so I could get it. I've heard of a technique that can control. Like, I need it. Well, look at Lilia's skin as well. I want to look at everything, all the new stuff. 
me let me get this stuff though. I'm clear. All right, let me get out of here. I need to redo my my island thing, my wilderness. Okay, our dailies. Um, prisoner in a cave. Is he gonna show us the new uh the new trailer? <laughs> I love the trailer. Oh, the trailer's so good. Your watch was telling the wrong time. Pardon me. Verdon. Oh, I fixed it for you. 2007. Bro, that's yeah. concerning 2007. Is 2007. Is it not? Oh, let me turn up the volume. We believe everything can be translated into numbers. How's the volume, you guys? Things are made up of numbers. And mathematics is the key to oh, opening the so pretty. Of truth. How is this possible? You use a maths model to forecast the storm. Bro, that's so and its cute. results perfectly match what the foundation recorded. We just worked out the patterns and the number sequences. Close your eyes, Verton. Close your Truth. eyes, Verton. Reveal itself to you. Truth. No, stay away. <gasps> stay, stay away, Arcana. Who broke the silence? Sanette is in detention. They're planning to sentence her to death. Those of you who agree to the death sentence may remain seated. Who wish to commute Miss Sanetto's punishment? Put your pebble into the pot in the middle of the hole. The pure blood I Dude, I'm so excited to play chapter five. The unknown arcanum power. And the obsession with certain knowledge or identity. Sound familiar? And Lilia. Oh god, Arcana. <laughs> I take not thought for needless disputes. Dude, her voice is so good. Her Arcana's voice, like, she needs to stop so I could stop being tempted to simp for her. Chapter 5 main story. Okay, I- oh god, I want to play it already, but we need to finish chapter 4. I need to finish chapter 4. I also need to switch who my main person is to actually get, like, you know, bond from them. But I just can't cheat on Regulus, you know? Let's play that record. Okay. We're at nine pity. We're at nine pity. I don't know if I'll be able to get her. Oh yeah, let me show you guys as well. The new skins. Oh. Dude, the Leah looks so good. She actually looks so good. Oh, I like how they just tell you how much it cost. That's actually pretty nice. Like, in, in, okay, wait, hold on, let me move. Let me move so you can see what I'm talking about. If you have the drops, it tells you how many like crystal drops it takes, but also if you just want to buy it, it just tells you how much it costs to buy. I kind of like this quality of life. Also, seven dollars for for a whole ass skin is so cheap. Like, tell me any other gacha game that provides you skins that's not twenty five dollars minimum for a skin that changes like the full like the full animation sequences and everything. Yeah, with animations too. I mean, like his skin's cool or whatever. I just don't care for him. <laughs> Oh yeah, and these two are getting reruns as well, which is nice. Oh, but you can't spend money on theirs. Only like the 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 crystals. Oh, regular's my baby. Oh yeah, it's the new month, so let's get these. The way that you can you can get these, like 10 of them per month is insane. It's actually insane. Okay. Regulus, what are you doing in there, sweetie? Okay. Surely. Surely. Surely I'll get lucky, right? 
Right? We're at nine pity. Do, do, what's hard pity in this game again? A list of codes? Oh, I don't know if I got all the codes. Let me, let me try them out real quick. I might have already put them in and I forgot. Remember to use my code, reverse live. I feel like I already did this. Yeah. Oh, expired. Hey, why are you giving me expired codes? Expired. Well, you know what code's not expired, you guys? You know what code's not expired? Reverse... I can't type. Reverse live, guys. Guys, reverse live. The code that they gave me for you guys, for you guys to use. Reverse live. Share it, share it amongst the people so that they can also get 60 drops as well, okay? A regular, a regular prime is a new one. Okay, let me try that. Regular prime. Awesome. Okay, but my code gets you 60 clear drops, not 30. Just saying. Just saying, reverse live gets you 60 drops, uh, clear drops I instead of 30. So, you know, my code was better. Just saying. Try TY for your review. TY for your review. Oh shit! Why is there so many codes? That's awesome! Okay. Yeah, 37 for 30. Oh, how did I do that? How did I do that? I have 37 pulls for 37. I'm a. Oh my god. I'm a little crazy for that. It's like it's fate. It's fate. All right, all right, all right, all right, all right. Surely we'll get her. Yeah, surely. Come on, come on. We're at nine pit. Okay, shit. We gotta warm up. We gotta warm up. She wants to use the 37 pulls, you know? Okay, that's a five star, I think. Whoa, three five stars. Are you a brave speaker? You look like one. I just, mm. I just use my my thing and on. Sound like two. Bloom, I just used mine on you. Greetings to you, fair lady. May I present you a rose? And tenant, the girl kisser. Uh -huh. We'd love to see it. Okay. Oh, is this another tenant? Oh, sweetheart. Hello, dear. Oh my God. Do I still have to tell you my name? Or sign my name first. Oh? Okay. Alright, come on, 37. Come on, 37. Right here, right here. Okay. No, I think that's still a five star. Okay, whatever. I don't want it. Oh, we got Necrologist. Cool. Alright, come on. Okay, Bloom. No, not Bloom. 37, please. Come on. Alright, come on, girly pop. I think that's still a five star. Okay, okay. Okay, listen. 37, I, I really need you to come home. How do you tell the difference? It's very subtle. It's very subtle. Yeah, it's purple, so that's nothing. Oh god, I. Oh, it has to be this one or nothing. Okay, 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 six star, six star. We have to win the 50-50. Okay. Okay, 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 37. 37. We need to win, because I don't think I have enough for another 10 pull. We need to win, 37, please. Please. Yes! Amanda Brock said, that's right. Never lose, I just never lose. Island. We never lose, we just won Shemaine. We just won Kala, and now 37, in the bag, in the bag, but now I have none for freaking six. Now I have none for six when he comes out next. But no, Jessica. I tried so hard to get Jessica, you guys. You don't understand how hard I tried to get Jessica. 
I, I, I tried so hard for Jessica, and she just didn't want to come home, okay? She didn't want to come home, okay? I tried so hard. You can skip six for a deal? No, but I like six. I, I think six is pretty. I like him. I'm so, oh God, I'm so glad we won. Oh, I'm so glad we won. Thank you, 37, you're great. It's a bit too quiet. It's a bit too quiet. Aw, oh, yeah. Aw, oh, yeah. Do I have the mats to level her up? That's another question. That That is another question. Guys, look, I finally got her to 45, okay? I'm, I'm, I'm almost gonna get her to 60. It just cost a lot. All right, where is she? You're back. Of course you are. Because this place is the origin. Ba, 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 ba. All right, insight. I need salt. Warehouse. Okay, I'll just I'll just do that. Oh shit! I need these two. All right, we'll deepen her insight. Oh, she's also a star. The next quadrant. Is she? Okay, she's mental, right? What team does she work with? Her materials are on event shop? Okay, then we'll, we'll play the event later. Okay. Lilia, Tooth Fairy, Geo. Okay, I, I, bro, I don't have Geo. Okay, well, characters that currently are out. She deals true damage. History first, event later. I know, we need to finish up your four first. Learning level 37. Dude, how does this keep happening? How does this keep happening? Wait, that's kind of crazy. We I keep getting 37 around her. That's like kind of creepy. Crit team with follow-up. She's basically your Dr. Ratio Topaz. Early pop. Okay, hold on, let me see. So who can I put her with? Does she work with Melania? No, why not? I mean, like, I have Lilia, but Lilia's just not, like, leveled up, you know? So, okay, Lilia, who else? Does she work with Kala? What about Kala and, and Lilia? Lilia, Tooth Fairy? No, Tooth Fairy is dedicated to Regulus. Kala, Miss uh, New Babel, or Lilia? Kala, Tooth Fairy. Guys, Tooth Fairy is with Regulus. This is my perfect team comp right here, okay? Super greedy team, but they have follow ups. Huh. Hmm. We'll take that. Thank you. Okay. Okay. Now, should I? I, I want to play the new events, but I know I should also play the story. Like, I know. History first. What's history first? Story first? Chapter four first? I need to do the story. So I need to finish chapter four to do the, everything else is what you're telling me. Well, technically I've done the other, I've, okay. In the eyes of the game. Chapter six logs, okay. In the eyes of the game, I have finished chapter four, okay? I've played it in the eyes of the game. When you're sailing on the sea, there's a record player. I just haven't, you know, I just, I haven't, like, you know, read it all. No, I'm not a story skipper. I just, you know. Okay, did we stop at 10? Did we, did we stop at 10? Or did I get to 11?
speed run the story. Bro, I don't think I can speed run. I very much like, I like to take my time and like enjoy the story, you know? Last one was, okay, yeah, I think I saw it. Okay, we'll just start here then. Richard tends to oppose. Gloria tends to support. Black Agate tends to oppose. Uzo, neutral. The situation doesn't look good. How's audio, by the way? Do you have any news, Mark? Do you have any news, Mark? Someone is spreading the minutes of your last meeting. Oh? I didn't get any direct evidence, but apparently every voter has read the anonymous minutes. The topic about Vertin. It has become a great disadvantage to us. A great disadvantage to us. Hmm. You wish there was drops for a reverse 1999? Well, you're in luck. Well, it's not drops. Um, I do have a code. Use code reverse live and you'll get 60 uh, clear drops. So, so there's that. I'm gonna put that in my title real quick. Reverse live for, um, Okay. Yeah, use the code. It's Pog. <laughs> it's Poggers. Double envelopment. A 4-4.00 four, four approach. No wonder that the draft goes through so easily. To reject the draft during the committee meeting does not actually address the real problem. The House of Intergradas can still resubmit the draft during the next legislative session. Auto button, so she is planning for the long term to bring down the voting stage and make it a plan that is totally abandoned. Is it a mobile game? It's also yes, a mobile game. I'm it's both PC so. and mobile. A draft that has failed to win votes can hardly win the trust of the house's reviewers again. His British is so like it won't be submitted to obnoxious, the like regulus. I love it. The draft has failed to win the votes. It hardly. She counts the names on the whiteboard again. Did anyone make any actual move yet? Not yet. I really the like Madame Z. Change their preferences. I feel the like she really cares for Verdon. Stab still remains the same. Hmm. Just as I expected. This draft is not about Verdon, but a promise to the future. About how to balance the benefits between different interest groups. To reach that, we need to meet the expectations of those groups who have a need for flexible management and also appease conservatives and not shake their confidence in controlling the overall situation. God, the politics in running anything. Actually. Actually. The delegate adjusts his tie and interrupts Madame Z in a clear voice. We do have an opportunity to change the game now. Oh? I love the BGM. You only got one shot. Do not miss your chance to blow. Oh, a TV. Oh. He puts in 0411 on the keyboard attached to his wrist. Okay, hold on. It's going automatically. Committee mem member Pedra appears on the screen. I hereby challenge Delegate Mark Hall to a public debate on the revised draft of Storm Reformation, Manpower, and Discipline. This draft of his will bring unpredictable risks to the Foundation, yet Mark himself seems completely unaware of it. I believe it is necessary to make such risks public in a legal way. The delegate switches off the projection. As he turns to Madame Z, his cheeks have become rosy in heightened spirits. See, I knew they were going to escalate Burton's issue. I knew they were going to escalate Burton's issue. You want to accept this challenge? the internal media are reporting the news. If I step back, they will definitely humiliate me and take advantage of the public opinion to undermine the draft. Mark, that's a menacing move. Oh my god, Menace Mark, his new nickname unlocked. Madame Z picks up Pedra's name card and sticks it to the board. 
It is coming for us. That is so ominous. It is coming for us. It is coming. No matter fight or flight, they have comprehensive preparation for this. I would suggest taking the long view and not jumping to conclusions. But defense without attack will never bring us. Oh my god, you know what? I've always wanted an opportunity to defend the draft in public. You thought the code was a meme? Why would it be a meme? I'm giving you guys a code. You're welcome. Share it online too. Make sure everyone gets to see the code, okay? Concerning the questions they implied about Verti, I've collected more than enough cases. He does have a name. His name is Mark Hall. Misleading questions twist people's opinions. It's time I'm to. I'm sorry, no, it's okay. Truth. It's okay. <laughs> it's okay. It's okay. The reverse team is super sweet. They were very kind to give us a code to share out. The gaze between Madame Z's glasses has become subtly piercing. You have accepted it. Was it in front of the media? In front of their salad, bro. I was there when Pedra challenged me. So were the media. Well, I don't think it's going to be a complete mistake. The lady in white seems to loosen up for a brief second. She doesn't say a word. But walks up to him and gives him a pat on the shoulder. It is a crucial debate. Do your best. Do your best. Okay, where's Regulus though? You don't have to come along with me. I'm here to repel the pests in the woods. It's part of my daily routine. Thank you for your kindness, Miss Drubis. God, so the bee is so cute. It is fun to stay in Miss Burton's suitcase. But I really feel like seeing the world out there. By the way, the pests you mentioned, what are they? Druvis, I lost. <laughs> you guys. I've heard of a kind of giant worm called the Tatsal Worm. They live in caves, about two to five feet long, and their heads are like cats. Oh? Be very careful if you see one. Both its skin and breath are toxic. Druvis bends over, lifting a hanging branch to make a way for Sotheby to walk through. <laughs> I have never heard of such a terrible worm. She what? Hopefully we will not encounter any. Where's Regulus though? Sotheby jumps briskly over some roots crawling by her feet. What are we disinfesting this time? Oak processionary moths. I like that Drew has like adopted so to be though. Perhaps. It's not enough to only rely on potions and arcanum to keep the woods in peace. Do you think she just carries like oak trees this around here. all the time? And everything will change with it. Animals that live in symbiosis. Fungi that depend on each other. All of them will embrace diversity by the day. Sotheby suddenly looks up and points the direction to the edge of the woods. Do you mean that? A group of grey fluff is flying over there. Got her little sparkles. Druvis looks in the direction her finger points to. Clusters of fluff in grey and brown coming together and forming a flossy tornado in front of them. Fly and dance in the air. A swarm of oak processionary moths. They're That's a big ass something. word. A fuzzy figure in red at the center seems familiar. Miss Druvis, let's help out right away. In red, who wears red? I already did the fight. <laughs> oh, it's Apple. This Apple is deeply grateful for what you've done. I almost thought I was caught in a nightmare. This Apple has never seen so many moths. He is trembling from his stalk to the bottom. Ugh. This apple is going to have PTSD from insects. <laughs> they are very sensitive to the scent of sap. 
With all due respect, not an apple with PTSD. Mr. Apple is quite attractive to insects. So it was the scent that attracted them. No wonder Mr. Apple's invisibility didn't work. Thank goodness we're here. Druvis carefully cleans off the fluff on Apple with her handkerchief until he restores his handsomeness. <laughs> Wait, are they confirming that Apple is attractive? Are they are they actually confirming that Apple is just like attractive? Cuz that's wild for them to do. Mr. Apple, did you find out anything? Yes, Miss Druvis. I brought something insignificant. Oh? As we planned earlier, I disguised myself and reached the office building next to us. As a bow tie? There is a device to detect arcane power at the entrance. However, this apple pried out what we needed from the guards. They don't need to confirm it. It's already obvious. Oh, you're so right. What? Have you guys seen what this eye it? too? Did Miss Burton win on that voting list? Sadly, not yet. It's not time for a formal vote. Everyone is cautious and remains neutral. Apart from that, there are some rumors in the Foundation. They are not very favorable to Verton. Rumors. It sounds as though the situation that Madame Z handles is more complicated and volatile than I thought. However, the votes have not been lopsided under such bad circumstances. Perhaps that means the Arcanists who share our aspirations are not in the minority. That said, I'm afraid we are starting a protracted war, Miss Druvis. Oh my god, war. Yes, I know. I've taken inventory of the supplies. We can still hang in there for four weeks and a half. Although they have cut off the water and electricity supplies in the building, we can still live on the resources in the suitcase for a while. God damn! There are fewer guards destroying the woods. Probably because the Abydus works. What worries this apple is that if the procedure to finalize the draft takes more than four weeks Guys, and a I'm half, still thinking about Regulus would... releasing a broadcast declaring a war. That was so funny. We would then survive by gradually shrinking our territory until Madame Z's draft is officially approved. We have chosen the thorny trail. And so we are destined to burn our boats and never look back. Burton. She is worth fighting for. Aww. For this point, Captain and this apple have absolutely no disagreement. Then this apple will keep scouting around for updates. You skipped all of these, so but holy shit, Drevis' voice is hot. Dude, the story is the best part. What do you mean you skipped it? It's okay, you get to you get to enjoy it with us now. Hmm? Sotheby's eyes are fixed in another direction. What are you looking at, Miss Sotheby? You skipped it too. No, 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 no. I, I wanted to finish playing the game and, you know, be able to level up Matt, so I, I skipped it, but with the intention of watching it on screen. Over there, it feels like someone is staring at us. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. They both look over that to that corner. There is nothing but shadows. The darkness looks like a pond of unimaginable depth. Druvis stands up. Let's go back. To the deep woods. Uh-oh. To be continued. Onward! We have to hurry up, you guys. We got a zoomies. We, we, got, we got a zoomies. I miss Verin. My, my MC, you know? Committee member Pedra walks out of the changing room. He sees Delegate Mark sitting in front of a mirror and shaping his sideburns into sharp summits with pomade? A tie ablaze with bright colors is around his neck. Isn't that scarf a bit too high profile? Mark stops his beauty procedures and looks at Pedra in the mirror. I think it fits me just well. Oh my god, are they gonna have a Riz off? Huh, you chose a grey shirt. Wise decision. Is he, is he insulting his clothes? <sighs> Looks like you're fully prepared. 
Mark doesn't answer that question. Instead, he pulls out a volume of files and starts to draw and write on them. Ladies and gentlemen, allow me to introduce the first debater of the day, Pedro Paul Gonzalez Reyes. Graduated from the law school at the University of Sao Paulo, he is a member of the committee and, more importantly, the challenger of the debate. Pedro lifts the curtain and steps onto the stage. The other debater of the day is the delegate of the House of Integratus. Mark Integratus. Hall. Over the past 10 years, he has served the foundation by drafting countless acts and conventions. The topic of the debate today, storm reformation. And our discipline is exactly a work of his. I don't think I've ever watched a live debate. Not one seat has been left empty around the debate stage. Madam Z's eyes follow Mark as he walks into the lights on the stage with a big smile. The people on the stage are greeting each other. Madam Z takes off her glasses and wipes them again. Show us Madam Z without her glasses. The chamber is filled with noises. The confrontation between- I, right. I wasn't done reading! Both sides are seated. Before we start the debate officially, I suggest we give Mark, the draft writer, an opportunity to introduce the draft. Would you please, Mark? Would you please? With pleasure. Storm Reformation and its advocators believe in such a goal. In this ever-changing environment smitten by the storm, smitten. this draft will help the Foundation win the trust of a considerable number of arcanists who have different backgrounds and abilities fast in a more efficient in and stable way. That is exactly where I must raise an objection. That makes these amazing. Your turn to speak. The draft has a huge risk which Mark Hall has not realized at all. No, sir. I totally understand what you're trying to say. You have put forward several questionable arguments to prove Verton's suspicion of disloyalty. In response to that, please allow me to invoke the following cases to prove Verton's competence for leading the unregistered arcanists. Yeah, her competence. Please turn to page 373 of Verton's personnel file. As you can see, since Burton became the timekeeper, the number of unregistered arcanists she has rescued so far is 63. That's a lot. That is a number unmatched by that of anyone present. If that's not enough to prove her loyalty, let's continue. I have to say, Mark, you have completely misunderstood my point of view. I don't care what Burton has done but the feasibility of the draft. Oh. According to the existing regulations, the duties of educating and disciplining unregistered arcanists are taken by the School of Discipline. While you suggested in the draft that Timekeeper's personal teaching would replace the current collective training. Have you ever thought about the budget that we could possibly spend on it? The Foundation spends an alarming sum of money on education every year, and there is no way we pay extra for personal training. Uh, what budget? Um, I don't see why we're talking about budget all of a sudden. Oh no. Did you really read the draft? I didn't mention a word about budget. Of course you didn't, which exactly proves why you have never realized the risk I just oh, mentioned. Oh no! Oh no! Oh, it seems the real topic of the debate has just surfaced. I believe everyone in the hall is looking forward to where it goes. So, oh, the debate mo uh, moderators of Venice. Of point, we would like to know your real thoughts. Oh no. Oh, Madam Z. She gets up, walking towards the entrance. This is already a composition which the white would like to see. The flagstone is left there alone. That last move is also a defense in panic. If I were the player... 
She gazes into the air, lost in her thoughts. She doesn't feel the gaze cast upon her from another direction. Constantine is watching Madame Z from her corner. As Madame Z walks to the entrance, somebody stops her. A white item is handed to her. And then, she disappears as soon as she steps out of the hall. Constantine averts her eyes and looks back at the two debaters on the stage. What just happened? As soon as she has left the hall, Madame Z takes out that white note. What is it? Senato asked me to give it to you personally. Secretary Sharon. It looks like a simple, usual letter. Dear Madame Z, with this letter, I send you my best regards. All this music. I have been instructed to manage affairs on behalf of Timekeeper during her treatment. Please let me know if there are any missions to alleviate the situation. I will do my best to meet your expectations. Oh, Sonetto! Sincerely, Sonetto. Sonetto's such a puppy. Good news. Save us, Sonetto. Sonetto, save me. Didn't, um, didn't Jessica say that Sonetto smelled like a puppy? Flashing red. Oh, is Arcana showing up? Oh, you're also here? Oh, it's Lilia. Zeto hears her. She stops her practice. Yes. I am taking combat drills with the artificial somnambulism training system. Lilia cast a sideway look at the screen in front of Sinetto. There shows her overall time length of practice. Six hours. I'm not the Is only one drunk? goofing around. Why are her cheeks so red? No, I'm not. I am not goofing around. I am not goofing around. I am waiting for orders. Her face flushes scarlet. Lilia initiates the machine in front of her, unaware of her awkwardness. Well, much luckier than me. I have so many things to believe. <laughs> Beat Bakaloshe. Have you heard it? Literally me. <laughs> I should have turned down the offer when they promoted me to the Foundation headquarters. <laughs> they don't have any field missions for a flying witch. <laughs> She's so funny, Is dude. because of the provisions of talent protection? Only God knows. House arrest may be a better name. Hmm. She throws a casual glance at the screen. Look, since we're both bored to death, do you want to have a try at some difficult things? Oh? What is it? God, so that is so awkward. Hmm. I love her. It's... She pouts her lips, hinting at something which she thinks should be obvious to both of them. Have you tried the artificial somnambulism joint training? Put on the helmet together and switch to multiplayer mode. Oh my god, they're gonna play Two games together. Can take on a harder training mode. More insane enemies. <laughs> we love VR like here. In the arcade. Sneto stares blankly at Lilia as she operates the machines. Okay, shall I turn this red knob? She's a bit worried, not sure what to do. She has to imitate what Lilia just did. And she murmurs. Hmm. What is an arcade? Oh, baby! The floor starts to vibrate as the machine goes into function. The multiplayer mode has been initiated. I mentioned the zone. Parasha! It's been a long time. Why not have some fun? I want to see Sonetta play DDR. She quickly taps on some buttons, and the warning indicator on Sonetta's equipment suddenly flashes the red. What did you press? I switched to the hardest mode. <laughs> you better get it together. Oh my god, she's a menace. 
but there is no time to wait. Two words in big red font appear on the screen in front of them. Drill starts. Don't fail me, tough student. The helmet has cut off their vital fluids and divert them into a pre-programmed battlefield. The operator's vision is about to change. I am exhausted. I am Mina. Almost joking! They take off their helmets, slumping onto the floor together. Aww! <sighs> Their gloves are soaked in sweat. They subside into momentary silence, looking at each other. They burst into laughter in high spirits. <laughs> I haven't had so much fun for centuries. Girly Pop, you're like 16. <sighs> Aw, Sonetto. How many times did we die? Sorry, I cannot do math now. My mind goes blank. <laughs> Who would expect the Sonetto okay. to have a brain fade? Why the, okay, if you like, we're just listening to this with no, like, with no context. Dilia falls backward. <laughs> Sonetto leans on the wall, exhausted. It was a fight of veer, verve, vervy, verve, and vitality. Okay, whatever. There are only breaths, the wind, and the smell of the concrete floor. Have you heard the result of the debate? I heard that. The number of people opposing the draft significantly increased after the debate. Oh no. Hmm. <laughs> it's not going well. Soon will be the voting session. The opposition has taken the lead. I hope Miss Druvis can hold out. You visited them? I submitted a request to enter that building. The system arranged guards to accompany me to ensure my safety. The moment they entered the building, they started sawing the trees, saying that they need to carve out the path. Since then, I have not been there. Aww. Four and a half weeks. After that, they can't hold on for any longer. How do they all know really? it's four and a half weeks? In that case, the vote result has to come out before that. Neto is deep in contemplation. Hi. May the peace be with us. Okay. <laughs> Hello. May the peace be with us. May the peace be with us. Do you mind giving us some privacy? Privacy. Do whatever you like. They walk to the break room in the hallway. Here is Madame Z's message. Please visit her in the office on Friday. Ah, okay. Copy that. Thank you for the message. With pleasure. When's Verdin gonna wake up? I miss her. She nods and places her hand on her chest. Wish you a good day. Secretary Sharon leaves the room at a quick trot. When Snedo returns to her exercise equipment, she finds Lilia is about to leave the room. Are you leaving? Yes. She picks up her gloves and the canteen, but hesitates. She pauses for a brief moment, then quickly turns back to Sonetto. Do you know how the penalties for destruction of public property of the Foundation and Brawl are determined? I really thought she was about to say, do you know the Muslim man? Huh? Well, according to measures of the Foundation for Administrative Penalties, based on the severity of the circumstances, Fines will be imposed, and the offender's salaries shall be deducted accordingly in minor cases, while detention or expulsion shall be imposed in major cases. Gosh, she's such a nerd. The penalty also depends on what is damaged. For example, 
production tools, household goods, buildings, equipment, and facilities, etc. These are the properties that involve less cost and limited influence if damaged. If the number of people involved in a brawl is equal to or less than 8, and there are no major casualties, the penalty will be minor. Equal to or less than 8. May I ask what happened? Why are you asking this all of a sudden? Nothing. As I said, bored to death. What is she planning on so doing? So bored that I have been paying attention to the Foundation's regulations. Even the flying manuals failed to win this much of my attention. It's a nerdo. <laughs> That's funny. She waves her hand. She waves at her and so leaves long, out, looking back. Hopefully there's good news for us next time I see you. I like Lilia. She she's really growing on me. Like she's really growing on me. I was flashing red. Then build her. Don't get ahead of yourselves, okay? We are falling behind even further. A vote or two won't help us turn this around. A vote I or know. two won't turn this around. The move to deny was indeed useless. The arcanists that were on Bro, our side. Bro, this is so much faster when it's on auto and I'm not clicking. Why is that? I misjudged the situation in the debate. I was going to seize the opportunity and the initiative. She doesn't respond to him, only pacing back and forth in the room. To seize the initiative. May perhaps the chance. Ooh, look at her. Madam C is so pretty. 38 lines go across the board in horizontal and vertical directions. That is to say, don't pull back. Don't jump. Even when they're attacking. But to focus on the bigger picture. To win strong positions. To win strong positions. She seems to have a sudden flash of insights and reaches out one of her hands without being the aware of doing so. Tsuke. Then Are they the playing Go? Hane. And the black counter Hana here. The white stand. The black. What's that one Osai. anime? Hikaru no Go? I used to watch that. Through these moves, I see. The move to D11 can save us more than 10 Mukov stones. We can still win within 10 moves. Mark! Yes? yes? Are there any other things we can do? We need an Is it Madam Z a human? Can win us more or is she Arcanist? Moves. Give me the file of the uncommitted leaders, including those who were neutral about this issue in the beginning. Okay. I miss Schneider. He seems perplexed, but still quickly retrieves the files and starts browsing them on the chair. The room is in complete silence, except for the slight noise of flipping pages. Pause. No. Too young to be convincing. Noni, head of the Natural Resource Committee. Ooh, Noni's pretty. There are only three of them in the group. Center Bernard, leader of the Mankind Caucus. Get it. Bernard? Ah, oh, yes. He can be your man. He is eloquent and leads a group of eleven. All of the eleven are his loyal followers. Why is he uncommitted? I thought he would be the first to vote. Perhaps they believe it's a sure bet. Find out what he's been up to. But, Madam Z, are you sure you want to cooperate with him? This doesn't make any sense. We don't even serve the same group. I really Mark, like Madam Z's drip. We're all serving for the Foundation's future. I just want to know what he needs now. Huh. The office in Chicago, U.S. 
I like the parallels. He is trying Burn to cover that region with his. These thought processes is represented in Go moves while Constantine Bernard is chess. The employees there yeah, are guilty of serious was trying to beat a bunch of kids at chess. They discriminate against humans of different classes, and are suspected of committing electoral fraud in collusion with the local capitals. The Supreme Court's investigators have already intervened. But they cannot go out due to the storm right now, so the case is pending investigation. Chicago office. I've read the reports on there. I see. Great. Exactly what we can help with. Through what? Thank Do you for Sinedo. asking, Mark, because I don't understand. Oh, what's Sonetto going to do? I have a meeting with her on Friday. This may lead us to a win-win situation. Wait, what's Sonetto going to do other than Sim for Verdon? Wait, what else is what else is Sonetto going to do other than be a simp? That was a short-ass chapter. Best wishes for the upcoming victory. Follower one. It will be the final vote soon. It's a stunning victory for us. Cheers. 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 May the peace be with us. Simming for Verdon solves everything. Oh, you're so right. The group is fully immersed in the joy brought by a collective glory. <laughs> oh shit. Oh shit. See? Bernard. He must be in the wrong room. You can't find those friends who tell Balderdash here. Bernard stops them with the wag of a hand. He pushes his way through the crowd and comes up to her. What brings you here, our honorable committee member? May I have a word with you, Bernard? I love the checker aesthetics from everyone in the Foundation. Let me check my watch again. Hmm. It's three in the afternoon. I don't think I've drunk that much. I don't think I've drunk Could you that repeat much. that again? You want me to canvas for you. Canvas. That's a typo. That's funny. <laughs> to be more precise. To form a partnership. My, my. What a creative idea. What can you offer? What can you offer? Not supporting such a stupid draft next time? Damn. Or recruiting new Canvas Arcanists is different from Canvas, huh? Bro, I don't know English. What about a witness for the case of Chicago office? <gasps> He instantly frowns. Who is it? Give me the name. Oh shit, the music got serious. I will. If you collaborate with me. Or talk to me with a better attitude. <laughs> yeah, give her some respect. I'm sorry. Our philosophies have always been different. And that led to prejudice. But being mysterious won't show us sincerity for each other, right? Ooh, the music's going hard. A staff of mine is willing to testify as a witness. Her report can... Oh, she's talking about Sonetto here. Okay. That's Strong how she wants to use Sonetto. To negligence. It depends on the special prosecutor. But the evidence is strong enough to prove that you're innocent from setting up others out of your personal interest. <laughs> <laughs> you can't help breaking into laughter. Looks like you've got your own little bird. A oh, little bird. Sucks. They don't serve humans or arcanists. They're just puppets manipulated by money. I want to bring order back to that place. Order. And I've collected quite a lot of evidence against them. Yet the most ridiculous thing happened. In the second week after I submitted the investigation application to the Supreme Court, the evidence was gone. 
Oh? My men found their charred pieces in the garbage room. Someone threw them into the shredding incinerator. It was like I could do nothing but surrender. Um... You have a wolf by your ears. I understand. Bernard takes a deep breath before he starts to talk again. <sighs> but you're asking for too much. Eleven votes. We're on the opposite side. I can never persuade all of them to vote for you. Yes, you can. Besides, the court session of the Chicago case starts later than the final vote. Don't tell me you want the service before you pay for it. Don't worry. You can vote after testifying. How are you gonna do that? I will do what I can, in my power. Yes, Madam Z, do it! The vote won't start so soon. He raises one eyebrow. I can try for nine votes, or ten, for the appreciation of your political resourcefulness. Madam Z holds the hand waiting in front of her. Good luck making a better Chicago office, Bernard. Oh my god, look at this like political games, dude. I do like that the more politically heavy chapters are a bit shorter though. Alright, who's she playing ping pong with? Hopefully, like probably not Tooth Fairy, but I would love it if it was Tooth Fairy. Unlike the other days, Constantine isn't by her desk today. The light in the room stays off. She has her back to the door, facing the window. Daylight slowly permeates into the dark room through the rigid marble windows. Come in. I'm here to report the situation so far. A lot of people ship Z and Some Tooth Fairy. Yeah, I do. Have tilted in favor of the dragon. I'm people. How many? Not a lot of them, but enough to make the votes even. They have always pursued revolution in the Foundation. Looks like Mark has finally persuaded them. I heard Miss Z has been working hard on canvassing too. Canvassing. But the number of the conservatives remains the same. We don't have to worry about that. I believe we will I still love this music so much. What about the other groups? Still functioning as usual. Nothing special. Nothing special. By the way, Bernard and his men paid a visit to SPDM. I didn't get to talk to them. She turns back to face the window. Thank you for the report. You're welcome. <clears throat> Dude, Candace, Constantine, whatever her name is, <sighs> has such a long been neck. She's so persistent. Do you know why she's been so different this time, Pedra? Because Verdon is a sweet baby angel who's done nothing wrong, and you're trying to punish her. Sports field. I didn't realize you had time to invite oh, me. Oh, it's this one. This. I love her. I like committee uh, member two so much. Are you actually here to lobby? They I should kiss. See. I'll say both, cats. Yeah, cats. Back then when I was a student, I'd often invite my classmates to play ping pong after we left the laboratory. A cold shower after getting soaked in sweat is a piece of memory I can't forget. I'm just I I didn't say anything. I didn't say anything. Listen guys, listen guys, I said nothing. I said nothing. <laughs> you remind me of the old days. I love cats, dude. Dusty. You're the only one I can practice with here. Serve it, Madam Z. 
Let's serve it. Let's compete. Let's slay. <laughs> Backhand chop. Great. Oh my god, they're playing ping pong. I love ping pong. She nimbly picks up the white ball. Again. Ready to go. Yeah, they're on a date right now, you guys. I was there. Can't confirm. <laughs> nice shot. Madam Z strikes. The little ball flies over the net in an extremely low parabola and then goes into the unguarded corner of the table. Katz turns her body to one side, striking the ball back confidently. We are planning to revise some articles in the draft. The way that they're flirting Good while job. playing ping pong is insane. The art. Oh, the article is about strengthening the control of registered arcanists. You're right. We do need to improve the credibility of the foundation in the outside world. <laughs> Tell me more. I just like the that they sound out of breath. power to discipline should be transferred back to the school of discipline. Is that weird? Foundation. Am I weird for that? The foundation will conduct the unified risk assessment on arcanists. To ensure this team is always under control. <laughs> but in fact, it still belongs to the timekeeper, right? That is our minimum requirement. And you will not change. Oh? Oh? <laughs> I didn't expect you to compromise. It's another compromise. Dude, this is so cool. It's a reasonable amendment to the draft. Transferring the power of education and discipline to the foundation will help lower the budget and reduce the pressure on Virgin. And you would even lobby an opponent, me, for this amendment. This is so cool! A reasonable appeal shouldn't be rejected just because it is raised by a different faction. The foundation needs solidarity, not contradiction. If the draft is meant to pass, I will this do is insane. to make it meet most expectations. Just like this ping pong game. Friendship first, competition second. Legislation shall serve the people. That was so cool. You have my vote, Madam Z. That was so cool. <laughs> A vote is not the only thing I need, Katz. I need you. I, that was implied. That was implied. Uh. Dude, that was that scene was so cool. That was so freaking cool. Oh my god, they got so creative with that. I love this game. We're also so close to chapter five, you guys. Constantine. Oh, chairwoman. Hello there, Miss Ma'am. Hold on, hold on. Why have I never seen Chairwoman before? Like, she, she kind of looks like a gilf. Tell me I'm not the only one. Tell me I'm not the only one. Come on. Constantine, sitting behind the rostrum, looks up and takes off her reading glasses and closes the book in her hand. Has the voting started? You see... Here is the number of votes I have estimated. The pro drafts will lose by five votes to their opponent. Don't forget our bet. Don't forget our bet. The one who loses will pay for the new stamps. What stamps are we getting? The final vote is not today. I'm afraid. Oh? She has a com complicated look on her face. The speech is still ongoing. She's just started the part on Article Three, Section Five of the rules. Is she of is she gerrymandering? Is that is that the, is that the term? Sorry, I don't remember my seventh grade civics class very well. Is is, is this called gerrymandering? Wait, 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 what's it called? Filibuster. What's what's the Jerry shit? She's filibustering, when they keep talking to just make things keep going, to to delay processes. But the speech has already lasted seven hours. Jerry Mandering is for both. Even okay. some delegates have left. Uh, what? She smiles surprised. Oh. 
she said the word. She, she, oh, she said it. Okay. Yes, and Katz's speech will be right after that. So, I guess the final vote won't start until tomorrow. Yeah, you were expecting a filibuster. Make a difference. You bust those nuts. Delaying the vote won't change the result. Constantine sighs. I don't know yet. I didn't expect that she would be trying so hard. Hell yeah, brother. But for me, this is not necessarily bad news. The filibuster will only have two outcomes. Yes. It is either one of the parties wins over two-thirds of support and gains victory. Or both parties get stuck in a tug of war. Well, isn't that both scenarios right now as well? If this tug of war doesn't end with a clear outcome, the storm reformation will end up completely dead and forbidden to be discussed within five years. What? Are the stakes getting too high? Five years? Someone trots over from the doorway. As he comes up to them, he bends over so that only Constantine can hear him. Madam Vice President? Mr. President came back from the Pax House. Mr. President's here. Oh, I will go see him now. Mr. President's here. He's waiting for you in the office. It has been over a year since they last met. Constantine quickly trots along the hallway. The window is clear enough to give reflections. She stops and fixes her collar. The door is left half open. Have we ever seen the president? Mr. President. Good day to you, sir. May the peace be with us. May the peace be with us. Are we, are we not going to see his face? Are you feeling better these days? I can still hang in for a few years. Thank you. Are they doing all is right? He... Just as usual. Nothing to worry about. He gives Constantine a small wave in the shadow. She walks up to I'll him. I'll stay in the Foundation these months. The agenda is well arranged. There is something more important that I must tell you in person. What's going on? Constantine nods and bends over to listen. The shadow of the president casts on her. The rusty, feeble words are difficult to catch, but the meaning of every word makes her eyes wide open. This is their judgment. What does that mean? What's going on? Yes. He sounds evil. Then I have no objection to it. She slowly resumes standing, then retreats for a few steps and almost falls on the floor. Hold tight, my friend. She supports herself by the file cabinet. Uh, excuse me. This is the first time I've seen Candace, like, or Constantine, like, scared. I was surprised. Thank you for telling me this. Um. Road of a puppy. Is this about Sonetto? Is. Is this chapter about- is, is this section about Sonetto? Road of a puppy? It has to be Sonetto, right? As witness? Yes. Your report means a lot to him. I- I can provide the report, but I have no experience in court hearings. If I say something wrong, will it affect the special prosecutor's decision? That's an unexpected question. Madame Z's voice turns gentle and soft after a moment of speechlessness. <sighs> Sonetto, testifying is not taking exams. 
The this music is so soft. Feel for witness. Just honestly tell them what you saw. Focus on the point, and don't distort the facts. The Supreme Court. They value the sense of Madam justice. Madam Z is so use. mother. Sense of justice. And that's a noble quality you have. I will do my best, Madam Z. Call the witness. LKDA, thank you for the prime. Call the witness. Entangled by the crowd, Snettle walks into the court. In front of her, the special prosecutor has an almost godlike, solemn look on her face. Greetings. May the peace be with us. May the peace be with us. Bro, go, go outside, special prosecutor. Senator, Why are you so pale? As informed by the subpoena, you have been called forth by the accuser, the subpoena, Bernard bro. Wilson, to testify as the witness in court. Could you specify the relationship between you and the accuser? Yeah, they're dating. We did not know each other. Huh? I heard of him at work, but we rarely work together. So they're talking about Verdon. Then why did he call you? I was one of the parties involved in the 1929 storm incident. I submitted a detailed report of that. He searched the database and found the report, so he made a request for access to my supervisor, Madam Z. Then, Madam Z asked if I would be willing to provide the report and attend court as witness. Could you tell me the reason why you agreed to testify? Because she was asked. I... My immediate supervisor is having a long-term treatment, and there are more time slots available on my schedule. <laughs> I am happy to be able to make a difference during the time and defend the established facts. More importantly... Oh? Snettle musters her courage and presents a box of files on the desk. I personally believe that there is still much room for improvement for the Foundation's office in Chicago in the United States. United States. The special prosecutor seems slightly surprised. What is this, Miss Sinetto? Your mom. This is a record of all my travels from the time I received the promotion order in the research center to go to the office in Chicago in the United States, to the time I went back to the headquarters of the Foundation when the storm came. This is the field report and diary I wrote about the storm in 1929. What point do you make? I would like to prove that the Foundation's office in Chicago in the United States violated the declaration, fight for the peace and order of mankind, and the rights of some humans and arcanists. Yes. Yes, Sonetto. Yes, Sonetto. Let's go, Sonetto. Someone leaps to his feet on the other side of the table. He is the assigned director of this constant, constituent, whatever. Defendant of this court. I request a debate duel. I won't allow her to distort the truth like this. <laughs> I challenge you to a duel. Mr. Theft, I haven't checked these files yet. Silence, please. Yeah, yeah, shut up. Your Honor, you can examine the files one by one while we're having the debate duel. Why <laughs> do you want to duel so bad? I can't bear to see the long history of our office slandered Snetto, in this I day challenge you to du 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 duel. Dude, he wants to duel her so badly. She's going to destroy you. Sonetto is an investigator with rich combat experience. There is no good dueling with her. Yeah, yeah, you say it, Special Prosecutor. The Special Prosecutor turns to Sonetto. Do you accept the debate, Duel? I have no objection, madam. The defendant's neck has turned scarlet out of anger. The Special Prosecutor stands up and raises both of her arms. Please, to the stage, duelists. Oh my god, they're actually dueling. The debate during your duel will be faithfully recorded. Three defeats in the debate of one side will end the duel. You have the floor now. Schneider, a friend we met in Chicago. 
She once chose to join the Foundation under the pressure of both the Storm and Manus Vindicte. But instead of offering any solution or help, you just gave her a rejection letter. Schneider! I found this letter in her suit pocket. It had a small line written on it. Poppers... Fuck off. <laughs> what this was about it had a small line written on it poppers fuck off <laughs> Oh my god, I love how she said that. It had a small line written on it. I love how she said Poppers fuck off. <laughs> the music is so dramatic too. Like like the music is so dramatic. It had a small line written on it. Poppers fuck off. <laughs> I'm cr I'm crying. Oh my god, that's so funny. Like, this is such a, like, a serious moment. They had her say that. Like, they censored bitch, but they're not gonna censor fuck. Not to mention the fact that no one at the office had ever heard of the storm. What help could they offer? In this particular case, you should have reported to the headquarters or to the investigators out there instead of doing nothing but leaving an insult. I do not understand why there were such wording on it. Yeah. Was it because she did not pay enough shelter fee to qualify for sheltering? Or was it because the wand she used was transformed by Arcanum, which made you think she was an Arcanist? Does not the Declaration of Peace say, everyone strong or weak, rich or poor, oh, she got the Italian hands out. helping hands so that the existing peace and order shall be maintained? You don't debate with someone who's a walking dictionary. This girl is the encyclopedia of the rules. Like, you can't debate with her. Like, it is, it is unacceptable. <sighs> they were humans. If only they had made it to the headquarters sooner. Maybe they... Oh. In the particular circumstance at present, it's impossible for the headquarters to take in humans from all over the world. Neither. But you bring out a possibility. A possibility better than anything that happened. Thank you very much for your testimony, Miss Sonetto. And also for the debate, Mr. Seth. The special, uh, the press, the special prosecutor and the jury get up. Gathering the papers on the desk. Hold on, like, I, just, I just need to hear it one more time. It had a small line written on it. Poppers, fuck off. It's so funny. It's just so funny. It had a small line written on it. Poppers, fuck off. <laughs> Sonetto's ears are gradually cooling off. I seem to be oh my God, too I emotional love it. just now. She passes the hallway, feeling completely lost. She feels the court session is not over, and she is still in the middle of the storm. Miss Sonetto. The special prosecutor stops her from behind. You brought us a great debate. Aw, thanks, special prosecutor. In the bright daylight in the hallway, Snedo finally takes a good look at the special prosecutor. This is quite an extraordinary face. White, hard, and a, of a skin texture different from any Have creatures. Have you heard of the Supreme Court? You should come, and you're free. Oh my god, is she? Oh my god. She's inviting her to the Supreme Court? Bro, she's like 16. Oh, road of a puppy. Dude, we're almost at the end. 
We're almost at the end of chapter four. That means we get to start chapter five tonight. I was told you have something important to share. Yes, the filibuster is about to end. Bro, this chairwoman is so hot. Like respectfully, of course. Like, like respectfully. This is like this Jilf right here, dude. Is so hot. See, he told me they are going to end the speech and apply for the official vote at noon. If you're going to continue with the debate, don't forget to send your men. Constantine doesn't reply. She glances at the delegates on their seats. Do you see Bernard over there? Yes. Quite a lot of his men attended today. They have remained uncommitted to storm reformation so far. I thought they wouldn't bother to attend. The opposition side doesn't need a dozen more votes to win, after all. But the advocates of the draft do. The chairwoman cast an eye on her, perplexed. Yet Constantine doesn't intend to explain. She looks weary. There will be a new draft given to you in two hours. I brought together a revision group last night with some hired experts. We have adjusted some of the articles in the previous draft. I will need you to present it to everyone when the time comes. What for? Is that draft going to be adopted? Is that draft going to be adopted? <sighs> The chairwoman looks ghastly. She can't help but ask again to confirm her suspicion. Oh, the draft is going to be adopted, isn't it? And there are things that even I cannot maneuver. All I can do is bring God, benefits neck is so to as many long. people as possible. I have specifically made some amendments to the clearance to educate and discipline unregistered arcanists in section 3 on page 21 as well as the duties and obligations of the Timekeeper's special team in Section 1, on page 40. Every Arcanist assigned to the Timekeeper's department will be put through the Foundation's risk assessment and graded accordingly. Ordinary Arcanists only need to receive primary artificial somnambulism training. The more extraordinary ones will be sent to the School of Discipline for Re-Education. Um, Delegate Mark also submitted another edition, which was quite similar to this one. Is that so? Is that so? She chuckles. It is a half-relaxed, half-bitter <laughs> smile. Well. Very well. I'm pleased we have reached a consensus even before we meet. Here are more things we have revised. Given their resistance to the storm, the Timekeeper's special team will take up more work related to Manus Vindicte. Oh no. Manus the Vindicte Foundation mentioned. Will utilize their abilities. She sits down on her chair. We have also fine-tuned the details. They will be given more executive power while the Foundation retains control over all things. Remember. We have to make everyone aware of these changes before the voting starts. We have to make sure this version of the proposal is the one that gets the final approval in the end. Understood. The chairwoman looks up, light sheds on her reading glasses, and gives out a bluish-white color. Can't believe this is happening. Huh. She's the so first fine. revolution targeting arcanists in the past decades. Don't forget my stamps for this quarter, Constantine. I feel like Constantine and Chairwoman should kiss, just saying. The right side of the hall is where the most eloquent people gather, the lecture area. Madame Z stands on the podium. After the long speech lasting for days, she feels her- okay, well. But her mind is getting clearer and clearer, more and more excited. Every cell in her body is ready to wake up at the very moment the voting starts. She looks at the rostrum. Constantine is sitting next to the chairwoman calmly. That is a strange calmness. 
so strange that she is almost certain that she is watching Constantine place a piece on the bottom right corner of the board. <sighs> like Madame Z and Constantine should also kiss, I but like toxic the eyes are addition. No, it's not the time to relax. Just two more hours. Hang in there. It will end soon. Oh, Madam Z, you've done so well, Queen. Um, we're getting so close to Vernon waking up, you guys. Also, where's Regulus? We're getting so close to Vernon waking up. Picnic on the lawn. <sighs> Regulus! Okay, so... The list of characters who I think should kiss. All right. I think Verdon and Sonetto should kiss. I think Verdon and Schneider should kiss. Actually, I think they have kissed. Um, I think Druvis and Arcana should kiss. I think I think Regulus and Verdon should kiss. I think Regulus and Sotheby should kiss as well. Um, I think Lilia and, and Sonetto should kiss, but I also think Lilia and Druvis should kiss. Um, Z and Tooth Fairy should kiss. Um, Jessica and Jennifer should kiss. Matilda and Sonetto as well should kiss. Who else should kiss? Everyone should kiss, yeah. I think Kala and me should kiss as well. I think that's a good one, too. 37 and Sophia should also kiss. Yeah. Apple and pickle. <laughs> Roast leg of lamb. Wellington steak. Hearing Regulus say Wellington steak is one of the most British things I think I could ever hear in my entire life. Turkish kebab. Oh, I want meat. Are you hungry? Worry not, worry not. The leaves of the potatoes we planted have turned yellow. Miss Druvis said this is the harvest time. Let's dig them out and make shepherd's pie. Aw, Sotheby, you're so cute. Potato? Vegetable? No, I don't want them anymore. <laughs> Regulus is so funny. I've been eating healthy salads for a month. Oh, baby. I want meat. I want rich, juicy, meaty, sinewy, savory, sizzling meat. Regula suddenly springs to her feet. Wait. It smells so good. Yeah, this girl needs her protein. That's meat. Where's that smell coming from? I do smell something good as well. Guys, remember, Regulus is from the 60s. I feel like veganism didn't exist back then. Sotheby stands on tiptoes, seeking the source of the incredible smell. <gasps> I'll take a look. I'll take a look. Regulus rubs her stomach, grabs her bag, and dashes out. Wait, Regulus! The critter's lair is over there! Oh, she's so silly. Critters? <laughs> no worries. Critter is a type of meat. Roast it over fire and a square meal is here. Re Regulus. <sighs> Smells so good. It's over here. She's using her nose. Is she the puppy? She is gone. What can I do? Father said some critters could cause hallucination and diarrhea if eaten. Oh no. Oh no. What's going on, Miss Sotheby? Why are you here walking around alone? Apple floats in the air and looks around them. Um, where is Captain? Captain, my captain. Oh, good to see you here. Regular said she smelled meat and went straight to the forest to catch critters. Bum, 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 bum. Waffle. Waffle. It has been too long since we last had Dr. Pepper. 
<laughs> Does Captain finally start to have a senior moment? <laughs> Confirm. If Regulus doesn't have Dr. Pepper, she goes clinically insane. <laughs> she needs her Dr. Popper. That's so funny. She gets yeah, she just she gets a senior moment. She just kind of goes through it without her Dr. Pepper. Let's hurry over and take a look. That's so funny. The smell of food is unusual. It's verdant over there. There may well be other dangers lurking somewhere. Imagine like the other side is just like they're cooking steak outside like the thing to like convince them to come out. You just got here what about the insanity in Dr. Pepper? Without Dr. Pepper a day, you'll go insane. Regulus's figure appears among the trees. The aroma of food has also become more intense. This is weird. Where on earth does the smell come from? Regulus is also looking for the answer to the same question. She looks down, scrambling in the weeds as she goes through them. The weeds unexpe unexpectedly shake, out of which springs a black shadow. <gasps> Blimey! It's a carbuncle! Regulus, it's not edible! There comes another one. One after another, until Regulus has an armful of angry carbuncles. That's the lair of carbuncles. They've been stirred up. Whoa! A bumper harvest of critters? Come and help! Hold on, Captain. We're coming. I now ship Regulus and Sotheby. Me too. <laughs> Are they really all inedible? <laughs> She's so stupid. I did smell the sizzling meat. Oh, it's somewhere around here. Right around. Oh, hi. I'm about to add Lily and Regulus to my, to my ship order. <gasps> Who are you? An athletic figure shows up from behind the bushes. Lilia? What are you doing here? Lilia throws her bag at their feet. A roasted leg of lamb wrapped in tinfoil falls out of her bag. I got you something good. Aw, Lilia! Roasted pork knuckle, farmer's sausage, black forest ham, some unknown drinks, Liba bread, Liba bread, and Liba bread. Whoa! Regulus pulls out the lamb as quickly as a flash and devours the meat. This girl's nose is absolutely insane. Oh, lamb, it tastes so good. So good. I barely know what grease is supposed to taste like. <laughs> <laughs> She's so happy. <laughs> Thank the great god of rock for his blessings. Oh, this pirate finally gets some meat to eat! Huh? It is me you should thank, the goddess of victory, who soon brings you freedom. Bring us freedom soon. May I ask, how should I God, I love this words? so funny. I love it when, like, you just see the team interacting. <laughs> Lilia sits down on the ground. She opens one of the cans and pours the drink into her mouth. You want some? Druvis takes the drink from her and takes a sip. Thank you so much for coming alone and providing us with supplies, Lilia. However, please tell us why you were here. Did Madame Z send you? Lilia shakes her head. She gives out four fingers. Already been four and a half weeks, right? This is not the first time I visit you guys here. <laughs> the one hiding in the shadow last time? It's you? It's I you. I wonder how much longer you can hold on for Verton. You see, saying is one thing, fighting is another. I've seen many deserters. Way too many. Many deserters. Crying out loud, peeing their pants, drooling all over on their rabbit food. But you guys are different. You actually did it. 
You conquered places in the Foundation, defended your own places, and put pressure on those in white till this day, the last day in this four weeks and a half. That's the Stalnaya Volia I appreciate. If I didn't come today, would you eat your boots tomorrow? They have potatoes. Of course not. We still have potatoes. Almost right. <laughs> Am I regulus? Yeah, they still have potatoes. And carrots. And carrots. <laughs> Thank you for your kindness, Miss Lilia. May I take it that you are coming to bring us the good news? Is there a final result for Madame Z's draft? So far as I know, Madame Z hasn't given up yet. I love how she said potatoes. It's her British, bro. She's so funny. Just like you. When she gets serious, she looks like a fierce doe. But I already lost my patience. Tons of processes need to be done before it can be performed. Even if the draft is passed at the final vote. As long as Burton is still on that bed in the ward, you're just an isolated island. Everyone can step on you. Lilia stands up and pats off the dust on her carelessly. Take care of them for me when necessary. That's what Burton said when she gave me the vodka. Aww. It's time to deliver on my promise. Aww. Are you going to do something dangerous? A thing that is worth the risk. I've been waiting for this moment for so long. Someone needs to wake up from the dream. Time to wake up, Verdin. It's time. Oh, we're finally gonna see Verdin. We're finally gonna see her. Oh, Final Mesmer. round of the vote. Voters, please hurry up. One minute to go. Please be responsible to your vote in every round. Vote as soon as possible. The draft advocates have more votes now, but they still need more than that to meet the super majoritarian requirement. Please vote now. 30 seconds to go. Final countdown. I'm so stressed. Ten seconds to go. Vernon, wake up! This will be your last chance to vote. Please, hurry up. Voting closed. Storm reformation. Manpower and discipline. Pass. Let's go. The <laughs> bucket <laughs> list. God damn, Lilia. <laughs> Holy <laughs> shit. The glass is not as hard as I thought. Hey, time to wake up, Verton. <laughs> she just shattered the glass. Oh, Verton. What's that sound? What's going on? Uh, nothing to see here. <laughs> Holy shit. <laughs> Holy shit, dude. Staff staying at- That Hello? was a quick reaction. Ajin, dva, tri. Well, relax. I'll keep the acceptable damage under eight. That's why she asked. What? What, what is this? That's- Miss <laughs> Mir Jr. crouches next to the stool, rubbing her hands aimlessly. The staff are putting on well-designed helmets as they come in. Everyone, get your gear. Formation one. <laughs> Capture the intruder. That's so funny. <laughs> Bring it on. Let me have my dear long lost real fight. God, I love Lilia. She's a menace. <laughs> Oh, now do I get to click? Emergency! Room 1525, calling for backup. No, 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 you have to keep it under eight. Lilia whisks away his walkie-talkie. Hey, no backup! 
I need to strictly follow the damage control standard. <laughs> Ferdin! Oh, baby! <sighs> Two eyes! Lil... Lilia? Oh my god, Ferdin! Finally awake? Nice! Time for us to leave. Oh my god, Ferdin's up! Come here and sit on the broom. Yes, behind me. <laughs> Grab tight. Don't say I didn't warn you if you fall down and die. Oh my god, bro. She just woke up. <sighs> oh, baby. Neither the mind nor the body is responding to her calling. No reaction be can be given to what's happening. She only knows to grab the handrail tightly. The metal handrail feels cold and hard. This is the result of everyone's effort. Right, Red 38, let's go! Oh, A strong shake. Mesper Jr. Mesper Jr., what are you doing? They're running away! Go, get them! <laughs> they are mad people. Save your whining for Constantine. <laughs> the broom rises into the air. It doesn't waste a second to pause, flying towards the open windows. The dazzling, glaring white light, so strange but also so familiar. Warm wind blows in the window. It's a cloudless, sunny day outside. <laughs> oh, Ferdinand! Oh, my, my friends. Ferdinand! Oh, baby! Returning birds. How do you feel? Getting used to the light? Oh my god, Lilia! <sighs> the wind feels so good. Dude, the animation's this is just crazy. An appetizer. I'll be gentle since you're just discharged. I saw the rainbow flash and she said I'll be gentle. Oh my god, this is so pretty. Right. Good as new. They stayed up all night just to save you. <laughs> I guess you're the only one who has slept tight. This is so <laughs> sweet. Madame Z, Druvis, Saneto. From the bill and the protesting to countless debates, planning, and this everyone is, so is pretty. holding their umbrellas for you, Burton. The storm, it will pass one day. <sighs> Thank you. Thank you all. Yes. Everything is going to be right. Enough flying. Time to head back. What are we doing next? Hmm. No idea. Meet your friends first? Fight with your comrade in arms. Fear no danger ahead. Okay, Lilia is such a good character. Grab tight. I'm going to speed up. The wind flows through them like waves. Don't loop de loop, she, she, she just in a coma. How are you feeling? Better now? <coughs> it, it, it's killing me. <laughs> what did she do? <laughs> Drink water? Some Dr. Pepper? Here's water. Captain, sip, please. Don't put too much pressure on your esophagus. What did she have? <sighs> this apple told you not to swallow leather in haste. What is leather? <laughs> it's just bread. <coughs> oh. I'm... I'm alive! Dude, Regulus has been going through it regarding food. Oh, I thought I wouldn't be able to see the sun tomorrow. Or see Vertin discharged. You will? Why are the leba bread here? 
Ooh. Oh, we get to make a choice as Vernon. You guys, it's been like four chapters. Really, it's been like it's been like a whole chapter. It's been like two chapters since we've been able to do this. Oh, Vernon looks. Oh my gosh, she looks so cute, my little Pookie Bear. Oh my God, I love her. Because Lilia. Wait, whose voice was that? Is it? Oh, my heart! Mixed feelings turn into tears running out of their eyes. Is, uh, is it shock or something? Okay. So many struggling days and nights. This is the finish line of desperation. Ahead of them, hope awaits. Oh, Vertin, you silly git. <laughs> what does that mean? Hello? Oh, now you come back. Oh, my heart! Oh, my heart! This is so cute! This is so cute! What even? Okay, guys, listen. I said I was I was a Verdant Regulus girly pop from day one, and they have a very special place in my heart. They really do. I, I I do think they both have better ships for them individually, but God, but God, these two, these two have a very special place in my heart. I adore them. They're ugh, it's so cute. Burden. Like it's just so soft. The family. I love found family. Burden. Oh. <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Regulus. Are you feeling okay? <laughs> I think our Regulus is just sobbing. Been connected to you. Do you feel any discomfort? Wait, guys, Regulus isn't blonde. She's a brunette. Do you need any nutritional supplements, Miss Verton? We have a lot of healthy, fresh salads here. Where did you come back from? What are all these white pigeons doing after you? You seem to have gained weight! No, 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 lost weight! Oh, no. I'm fine. Fit as a fiddle. Fit as a fiddle. Just a bit of a headache. Nothing else. It's good to see you again. Thank you for being here. Being around me. I'm gonna cry. I love them so much. Regulus wipes her face on the coat in front of her. Regulus, uh, don't, don't, Regulus, don't wipe your face on her coat. Of course. Of course we, we're waiting for you. You're the only friend we have in this world. Well, I mean, what about each other? All the waiting has been worthwhile. In the meantime, footsteps come from a distance. Don't ruin their moment. Footsteps of well-trained, strong soldiers. Welcome back, Burton. Oh, no. Oh, no, 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 no. A figure in a white robe emerges in the woods. We have good news to share. <gasps> Next to her stands Sonetto, Madame Z, and some unfamiliar faces. The moment in their eyes the moment their eyes meet in the air, Sonetto opens her mouth, but she eventually doesn't speak a word. Sonetto, say something! <laughs> this is good. This is great. May I ask what good news? I love how done like Verdon looks. The passage of the bill, Storm Reformation, Manpower and Discipline. Once it's approved by the PAC Security Council, it will become law. Your friends and you will enjoy more autonomy and a life with even fewer restrictions. You will also have a more respectable status in the Foundation. Ms. Z will fill you in with more details. Thank you for telling me this. Lilia, who has been quiet by their side the whole time, suddenly speaks up. What about the treatment? Treatment? Didn't it finish just now? 
This treatment has an investigative purpose, and the timekeeper has passed the examination as a safe, low-risk individual. As Ms. Z has said, Ms. Verton is strong enough to be the timekeeper. Huh? However, you will receive punishments for the damage to public property. I suggest you heed it as a warning. Yeah, but it was less than eight people, so it's fine. <laughs> she looks so done. <laughs> Constantine waves to the crowd. The rest of them are about to leave. We should say our goodbye. Please rest well. She suddenly notices the white dove on the tree and stops. Hmm. Seems like the dove of the white marble house is paying you a visit. The white marble house? What's that? What is that? What are they setting up? What do you mean? <laughs> Nothing peculiar. Who, um, who would- what? It just means you have come to their notice. Oh, not another- not another faction. For the love of God, not another faction. Please, no, I can't handle another faction, dude. One fear. No, I have multiple fears. I have, I have, I have, I have a lot of fears in this game. This is the end. Everything has been settled. Time flows by like water flows over a perfectly flat plain. Yes, that's right. Hmm, I got it. I'll reply you tomorrow. Madame Z returns to her office as usual. But this time, the secretary, who's always fully in, uh, who always fully engages in the daily agenda, looks up to her. Please wait, Madame Z. Please wait, Madame Z. She passes her a box. Madame Constantine asked me to give this to you. Did she say why? No, she didn't explain it. Sharon quickly goes through her head. Wait, I think she mentioned it's September 11 in the Chinese calendar today. Um. Erm. Um. Well, luckily, we can't go past the year 1999, so it's fine. It's fine, guys. We can't we can't go past the year 1999. We're chill. It's chill. We're Gucci. I see. Please send my thanks to her. Sharon nods and qu quietly returns to her seat. Madame Z looks at the box. A faint smell of red sandalwood wafts in the air. A set of brand new go. I'm glad to witness your progress. A gift card is attached. I'm glad to witness your progress. Bro, I think Constantine and Z should kiss. But like, angrily. <laughs> Madame Z closes the box calmly and puts it into her pocket. She opens the door and walks into her office. She looks around. This is just an ordinary room, normal, but practical. There are regulation documents, academic journals, and calendars and agendas. An old photo is placed next to the mirror. She sees herself in that mirror. Aww. The face in the mirror is a lot more a lot more mature than the young girl in the photo. Oh, Madame Z. Will a doe become a tigress? She runs her hand through her hair. It doesn't seem too long ago when she still had a braid on her to her shoulder. She combs her hair and splits it into three strands. Lay the leftmost strand on top of the rightmost go across then the right goes on top of the left cross and tie it up the braid bristles like an awkward sheep tail <laughs> who's your guys' favorite character so far she opens the refrigerator and takes out a plain cake under the cold light oh it's her birthday with a tight pull the lamp turns off 
the room quiets down again. Bro, they put all the animation budget into Madam Z. I'm still not over the ping pong scene. Happy birthday, Madam C. You did well. You did you did so well, Madam Z. We did chapter four, you guys. My heart, my actual heart, you guys. Okay. Like, I feel like I should play the main story before I, I dude, the art is so pretty. Okay, we don't have a lot of time. I, okay, maybe we do like one chapter of the main story and then we'll, we'll continue it on, on, on Tuesday. Thoughts on that? Thoughts on that? Like, we get started, and then, like, we'll just, like, continue on Tuesday. The Prisoner in the Cave. Bon voyage! This already sounds Regulus-related. There you go. Oh, whoa there, buddy. Clean. There is nothing we can do. We have another ten minutes tops before this ship sinks like a stone. Oh no, not the apple. Sixty percent of the left cabin has been flooded, as well as seventy-five percent of the right cabin. Oh no. The ship cannot survive such a ferocious storm. Timekeeper, we should get ready for evacuation. Hmm. Prepare the teleport soft disk. Oh, she got her hat Wait, back. What are you talking about? Are we going to abandon the ship? Oh no, oh no, not regular to ship, bro. These are just some breezes and ripples. I will last longer than a blink of an eye. Just hold on to the wheel and we'll Oh do, 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 do. Here comes a big wave! That sounds like the turbine just cracked. Great. So only two minutes left. Oh my god. A <laughs> true captain will never abandon her ship. Oh, Regulus. I've sworn to live and die with Rockin' Apple, the second of its name. Wait, what happened to the first? Then why is it the second? <laughs> I think Regulus and Lilia should also kiss. Exposed. From behind her sunglasses, Regulus's gaze drifts into the distance. Sotheby just bought us this ship. What? She what? So. so and you guys said, and you guys said I was crazy for shipping Regulus and Sotheby. Just saying, just saying. I wrapped my brains to think of all the assurances I could give to get that governess off my back. I think it's better for us to embrace the fact that all things would come to an end, Captain. 
Sometimes deserting oh, radio. Is another battlefield. Miss Radio. Why is she here? Hello? The rain washes the radio shell, the flower on top, which was once well cared for, now droops with weariness. Regula stares at the flower blankly. Then, her eyes widen as she suddenly realizes something. Oh, you're one to talk about deserting. <laughs> if it wasn't for you, we wouldn't have ended up like this in the middle of the... Timekeeper, <laughs> we have an emergency. <laughs> That's Aneto cutting her off. The teleport soft disk can't be activated. He cut her off while she was talking. That's so rude. I've tried other contingency teleport. God, I love Regulus. She's the comedic relief that we need. Area. Neither did the communicator. It's as if something is jamming the signal. I see. I have a question for you, Zanato. Please, Timekeeper. Hmm. Hmm. In the field mission evacuation instructions, apart from the part about asking the Timekeeper for help, is there anyone else we can reach out to for rescue? Uh, seriously, Vertian. <laughs> <laughs> Without hesitation, Regulus pounces on this radio. What's going on now? This is a trap! Regulus is so funny. Regulus is such a funny character, you guys. Like, she is so sick of this radio. It is so funny. And you are behind all this. It is you who played that nonsense travel note from 1999. <laughs> Dude, she is done. And lured us into this random sea in order to torture us, afflict us, and now feed us to the fish. Go ahead. Give us the wicked villain laugh, you manus mole. <laughs> Quit playing innocent here. <laughs> This is why she's my favorite character, you guys. This is why Regulus is best girl. I... I don't know. I mean no harm. <laughs> nice try. See what else you got to say when this pirate opens your battery cover and finds Maiden Manus there. <laughs> <laughs> Please, do not shake me. If... If I broadcast how to clean kitchen appliances for you now, Will it brighten up your mood? Like hell it will! <laughs> Can't you see? My ship is going down! Along with my record collection and your battery cover to the bottom of the sea. For good! Even John Lennon can't do anything about it now! <laughs> Not John Lennon! I'm terribly sorry. I can't see. I could only touch, hear, and imagine. God, I love her. I love Regulus so much. How about this program? Lesson 101, the express route to heaven one shouldn't miss. I think it would serve you better. Oh, I can't stand this anymore. Throw it overboard. Throw it overboard. My records, my Dr. Peppers, my pirate radio, my rockin' apple the second. For crying out loud, what have I done to deserve this? <laughs> Dude, her voice actor's killing it, though. Well, she did try her best to pick the music. <laughs> Though no one is in the mood, I think this piece is not bad. <laughs> As to Regulus's question... What is going on? We need to slightly twiddle this knob. To... 1913. I love this. Wait! No, we can't end there! That was so funny. You guys, that is... We're going to do another one. We're going to do another one. That's so funny. That is so funny. Yeah, yeah, we'll do one more. We'll do one more. God, I love this game so much. Just a reminder, you guys, use my code. No, don't use my code. Yes, mommy, yes, use my code. Uh, use my link to download the game. If you have not started playing Reverse 1999, do you see how charming these characters are? Do you not want to play this game for yourself and pull your own Regulus while she yells at you? Use my code or download my link 
And then also, use my code to get an extra 60 uh, uh, clear drops so you can also get the characters that you need. Use the code REVERSE LIVE. All right, guys, use that code, all right? It's a code that the reverse team so graciously gave me, so you got to use it, all right? Treasure hunt. This is... Oh my god, hearing Verdin, like, soothes my soul. The official letter of appointment from the Foundation. Congratulations, Verdin. After the long evaluation period and the re-examination, the Storm Reformation, Manpower and Discipline has been officially approved by the PAX Security Council. Team Timekeeper is now a legitimate Team Timekeeper, TT. You are now granted a more flexible autonomy and independent budget. They've been waiting in the suitcase for this document for far too long. What was that? Did you say budget? <laughs> Does that mean the Foundation will buy uh, uh, a sign? <laughs> me a new ship? Unfortunately, independent means doesn't rely on others. Damn. I can apply for a ship for you, but it's not guaranteed. <sighs> Misers. <laughs> Fine. Not that I wanted an obsolete ship painted in grey a shepherd check. <laughs> I love Regulus so much. Regulus mumbles and walks away. She's entirely lost interest in this conversation. However, the price of passing that bill is to let the Foundation keep its authority to discipline unregistered arcane. <laughs> she walked away. She popped up at the word budget, heard, saw that it wasn't in her, like, benefit, and left. I adore Captain Regulus so much. The arcanist who have been and will be assigned to the Timekeeper's team will be put through a risk assessment procedure carried out by the Foundation. A risk assessment procedure? Those who are in lower risk categories only need to receive primary artificial subnebulism training, while the high risk ones will go to the School of Discipline. But I will make sure they will be registered as members of Team Timekeeper. Oh, is know. that why, um, is that why Jessica went to the School of Discipline after, um, after the 1.2 event? Oh, okay, that makes a lot more sense. Wow. Who knew finishing Chapter 4 would make the events that happened make more sense? Yeah, because she's a high-risk Ar arcanist. Yeah. Wow. It happens further down the road. Yeah. Whoa there. That's... That's crazy. Oh my god. I see. I have only one question. Are you still our point of contact for the Foundation, Madam Z? I love Madam Z. Yes, of course. Then I have no further questions. Well, yeah, because Jessica's freaking yandere, bro. Freaking love Jessica. A smile breaks on Madam Z's lip. Team Timekeeper can apply for a secondment from the Foundation, Laplace, and Zeno, if necessary. Laplace. You can check this file for more details. Miss Z hands over a supplemental clause of considerable thickness. Fortunately, there are other things in more dire need of being checked for right now. What's our mission? It stays the same. Keep investigating the storm and manage Vendicte. Guys, I love Verdin. You can make your own plans of action. The Foundation only needs a monthly report on the results. You still regret losing your 50-50 for Jessica? You're same. You're in command, Verdin. Okay. You already have a target. Verdin, my beloved. I assume. That base the Manus used to keep its Eliti house four years ago. It has never been reversed by the storm. I'd like to investigate that place again. <laughs> so you've been there many times. Well, that'd make a good star for Team Timekeeper. I'll arrange for some people to meet you at the base. 
I think you'll have a great time together. Dude, she's so mother. Oh, they made it? Oh, the fog is thick here. <laughs> Bless you. The mist hangs heavy in the valley, and the temperature is somewhat uncomfortable for those accustomed to the suitcase. It used to be the nest of a Liti house, a kind of creature resting in valleys with abundant water resources. What's more, it's winter now. The leaves are indeed covered with a thin skin of frost. Regulus clicks her tongue and eyes the frog-shrouded gate of Zeno. So why do I have to be the errand girl? The Foundation wasn't even planning to give me a ship. She's so real for that. She's actually so real for that. She's like, what's in it for me? What's in it for me? Miss Sinetto is going through the procedures in the headquarters to transfer herself to Team Timekeeper. Mastruvis and Sotheby are on a break, for they have spent much time and energy clearing the woods and repairing the Foundation Square. Miss Lilia has been given an administrative penalty because she broke into the Rehabilitation Center not long ago. This leads us to the current situation where only the captain and this apple are able to act freely. Damn, apple really just said, here are the receipts. What? So in the end, was I, the renowned rocking pirate, the only one who didn't cause any damage to the foundation buildings? Yeah, what kind of pirate are you, Regulus? Oh, I have never felt so humiliated <laughs> in my life. You're not planning on destroying this place now, are you, Regulus? <laughs> No, no. Huh? God, I love her. Hey, see who's here. Lilia and a stranger. But yeah, who? Next to the rusty iron door, Lilia squats on her hunkers, looking extremely bored. What took you so long? Fell into a gutter? A graceful stranger is standing next to her. Wait, who? Hello, timekeeper. My name is Moisson. My employee ID is SF2760219190823X. x I believe Madame Z has told you about me. Um. Um. This is a thanks for the pride. Hello, Miss Moisson. Bro, I'm never going to escape the French woman in these video games. Oh my god. Hello, Miss Moisson. I am now an official member of your team. Oh, she is? Miss Moisson, welcome to the team. Madame Z said you were had a croissant. She's too kind to say so. In fact, I have a lot to learn from you. Also, Thank you for taking good care of Miss Sotheby. Hold on. You know Sotheby? Oh, Regulus is getting According protective. According to Z, Miss Morzan used to be Sotheby's private teacher. It is a long story. Let Miss Lilia give God us damn, an introduction dude, her, to the base. Her personalities. As the field operator, she knows this place better. Miss Moisson smiles towards the flying witch beside her, who has started to yawn. Someone has clearly grown tired of this humdrum small talk. <laughs> After I got promoted and transferred to the headquarters, those exciting outbound missions have been removed from my schedule. <laughs> In short, although it's called the base, the only place unaffected by the storm is the narrow, 20 meter long corridor, no larger than a hunter's lodge. No larger than a hunter's My former lodge. fellows had already searched this place from top to bottom. Those Laplace dudes had even sent in their lap dogs to search here inch by inch. 
found nothing but some excrement of the Alitius and the dog's own poop. There might be some clues that are invisible. Regulus is a specialist in optical arcane skills. Maybe she can find something. I thought she would be a specialist in like audio, a like audio specialist. ones. <laughs> well, I'll take that as a compliment. God, I love her so much. She's so stupid. But for the record, compared to searching, hiding treasures is more of a pirate's lot. So if it were up to me to hide treasures in this place... Regulus walks into the depths of the river valley. Please hold on for a second, Captain Regulus. The fog seems abnormally thick. Regulus halts and hesitates. Slowly, she turns her head. Oh! <laughs> Lucky you, they hit the jackpot right away. Bum, 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 hmm. bum, bum. There shouldn't be any ambush in this place. I see plenty of bushes. Easy, Miss Regulus. Please carefully retreat. Bro, to Miss Moisson is so hot. Miss Timekeeper, please cover us. Unknown attackers, everyone be careful. Oh my, I actually have to play the game. Because I. Oh, no, I don't. <laughs> I thought it was going to make me fight. Oh. I lied. I have to play the game. <laughs> I really thought I was done. I I really thought. Okay. Okay. I'm going to be real. Oh, I'm on auto. <laughs> Um, I would have done the exact same thing, Whoa, so it's fine. Panda Lily, thank you for the tier one. Thank you. Blue, I was on, I was on, I was on auto. Anyways, um, we're gonna debuff. Actually, we're not gonna debuff you. We're gonna debuff you. Um. They're just little They're games. Just little games. Rock, rock, rock. My Regulus is I3, level 45. Nice. I also think she is P2, maybe P3, I, P2 maybe? Uh, Voyager and Tooth Fairy are also I3. Um, and then, I'm gonna just auto it. Uh, Melania is also I3. I would max level my regulars. It just costs so much max, and I feel like she does everything. That one's at exactly at level forty-five. You know. Here, I can show you my characters. Hopefully. The way I haven't done my dailies yet is wild. Just really quickly, uh, yeah, we just really quickly do this shit. This trial is mine. <laughs> I'll say I can do this a lot faster instead of just the replay one. The event was daily to train to what? Bro. They reg updated regular skin effects? Yes, I saw that. I love that they did that. And the fact that they're, they also re-ran it. So like, you just like, you don't feel like you missed out on it if you didn't um, get it originally. Left hand up, now right hands up. Time waits for no one, even for a great. Ooh, two hands up. behind a bank. Wait, is it actually? I need to check that out. I also need to grind the event out. Because I want it. Because I want to make a second team revolved around 37. Hey, no I get it, it's not that grindy. No, most of the rewards in this game I feel like aren't like too grindy to get because I've been able to get most of them and I'm not the most consistent player like ever for like any game.
Anyways, do you guys know you can use my code reverse live to get 60 clear drops and, and a uh, energy a little candy drop? Don't touch my bag! Don't touch my bag! Nice! I really should update this. This auto battle, you know? Time waits for no one, even for a great. Rewards aren't a grind, but the drop rates are kind of bad on the purple that and above works. drops. Well, exactly. I mean, they gotta get you playing, you know. I should update this. I know I've been. This is all. This is. Oh god, this, they're all still like I two here. Oh, these are the dailies. Thank you for your sponsorship, Miss Sotheby. Okay. Clue 16. Okay, that's a new event. Hold on. Uh, I don't want to click it. I don't want to click that just yet. Where's the store? Where's the store for me to buy stuff? Click it. Oh. Apple coin. What is this? Maintenance. The black box, where? Back box, black box, where? Oh. Good timing. You seem to be more interested in the value of numbers. A truly marvelous hypothesis. I hope the margin is wide enough gotcha. to contain its oh. demonstration. A truly marvelous hypothesis. Okay, and this is hers, right? Is wide enough to okay, guys. Demonstration. Watch this. First try. Do the calculation again if the result is not what you want. It's also a step guys, then, watch to, this. to rule out the wrong answers. Shit. Congratulations. Okay, we did get a gold. There are only a very limited number. Okay, okay, guys, 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 watch this, watch this. Your luck is a good come on, come on. Oh, okay, okay, okay. No, 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 easy, easy. We're gonna get it, we're gonna get it, we're gonna get it. Do the calculation again if the result is not what you want. It's also a step you need to take to rule out the wrong answers. We're not hitting max. I'm gonna do it. We're gonna get it, we're gonna get it. This is it. Fast. An excellent result. Come on, I've always come on, come on. Have a better okay, than most real the wrong one. Wow. Those are treasures. Come on. Call them come on. Come on. Give me. Shiny give me the one I need. Give me the one I want. Come on. Come on. Result. Oh, you got a, a fragment. Do the calculation again if the result is not what you want. It's also a step you need to take to rule out the wrong answers. I'm about to grind the shit out of this event. I... If you guys come back on Tuesday and all of a sudden, and all of a sudden, all of this is completed, I promise you, I didn't read it. Okay, okay, I, I better. Pro I didn't read it, but but if all of it's completed, so it, like, j just I, I I won't do the gamba off stream. Now, but Lena. if I just have Keep a bunch, going, at least till part eight. Come on, it's the weekend. We know that you're not going to be asleep anytime soon anyway. Yeah, right? I know, but I don't want to endure stream because we're doing a 12 hour stream on Wednesday. So that, that's the main reason. No, but no, I just don't want to endure stream. All right. Um, when you're so we're probably going to end it there. There's some fights that have important dialogues of the story. Don't tell me that, guys. I need to. I need hey, to grind out this. I, say, I need to grind out materials, okay? Because I need everything. I need everything. So we're gonna have to grind out literally everything. But we are gonna end it here for today. We're playing reverse again on Tuesday, so I will continue the story there, and hopefully we get a lot further in the story as well. Um. Let's see. Let's see.
So yeah, we're gonna end it here. Uh, remember, use my link to download reverse. The currency farming is not from Sitch 5 but the inspiration from the proof event map BTW. Don't grind the wrong stuff. Oh, this one? Okay, that's easier. Okay. Alright, let's find someone to raid. Let's see, let's see. Let us see who we're going to ride. Um, we'll raid Umi. It's her one year, so we'll raid her. Um, be nice, be kind, be respectful, you guys. She's a good friend of mine. All right, you guys, use my link to download Reverse. Um, also use the code uh, Reverse Live as well, so you get some extra extra drop material. We always we always want that. That's always pretty poggers. Uh, what else? Next stream is gonna be Tuesday, 8 p.m. EST, as per usual. And we're gonna continue playing some reverse. We'll also play some Star Rail 2 through our weeklies and all that fun stuff. Um, Wednesday, Wednesday's super exciting. Um, it's gonna be my three-year anniversary. We're gonna have a 12-hour stream. And it's also gonna be merch launch. We're gonna launch some merch, it's so you guys can look quiet, forward to that as I'd well. Say. Thank you for all the subs too. And thank you guys for letting me or helping me hit partner music. plus as well. And thank you guys for watching uh, you know sponsor streams. I do appreciate that. So thank you guys. It means a lot to me. I will see you all in the next one. Oh, bye bye, bye bye, bye bye.